smile greetings smile evening smile greetings i'm very glad that uh, you are really uh, taking interest yesterday we started uh, our first day and today is second day and i hope that uh, we will definitely succeed our purpose is to uh, know correctly our healing system beautiful healing system so when we talk about sujok as you know now that su means hand and jok is foot yes we have touched this subject and very quickly we can just focus our yesterday's topic so professor park chevu he found that creator has created hand similar to human body yes you see this hand five projections like in body in our body our central part is squarish and from squarish part five projections are coming out same way you see on the hand this is squarish part and from squarish part five projections are coming out in your natural standing position your legs are touching or your feet is touching the earth and head facing the sky arms are hanging in middle same way you see in this position and when you uh, spread out your fingers and you touch the ground middle two fingers are touching the ground so this is representing your legs thumb is representing your head and side two fingers are representing your arms this is biggest similarity five projections yes yesterday we have discussed in detail just giving you framework so that we can continue uh, with our next topic so hand is similar to human body when you see so very quick bold points i am touching so when you see the joints yes arm has three joints legs have three joint here also you will see that legs yes legs middle two fingers legs have three joint arms have three joint yes and thumb has two because this is two yes one two and this is two same and then uh, proportion wise also in our body when you see five projections legs are the longest head is the shortest and arms are shorter than the legs in hand also you see the same story legs are the longest you see your fingers middle two fingers uh when you see from surface level you will see that your finger joint here yeah? this is finger joint but actually when you bend you will understand that this is just skin level line but here there is no joint so when you bend your finger you will see the joint here this is joint here so when you are measuring the length of the finger it is good to measure from here this is the joint here and if you measure you will find that these middle two fingers are the size is uh, near same okay so this is how you will see that all joints you you can see that all joints are similar like our body joints and then the biggest similarity what we saw yesterday was very interesting similarity thumb is the head yes thumb is the head when you see the structure shape and uh, the shape shape and the broadness as compared to your arms and legs arms and legs are long here also you see long legs long arms but this is round yes short this is the thumb which is representing the head and this thumb has higher status in hand like in your body your head has higher status head is controlling all parts of your body yes and also uh, without head your body has no meaning same way thumb is controlling all parts of your hand and you are doing all activities and the work with the help of thumb okay and also if 
thumb is cut, then we lose all our talents. Yes. So these are bold similarities which anyone can see. Even child can see. If you just tell child and give just simple idea, even child can see that hand is similar to human body. But then why uh, our ancient masters couldn't see? This is so simple because thumb was tilted. Yes, you see, thumb is tilted. If thumb was here on the top in vertical axis, then everyone could have realized that hand is similar to human body. But because of this tilting of thumb, this was delayed. And in this time, in present era, Professor Park Jehu realized that this hand is similar to human body. So now, the most important thing is, after understanding so many similarities and many proof, yes, we confirm that this hand is similar to human body. This is not by chance. This is plan. This is planned by him. This is very, very clear sign that this is not, not by chance. You see, each part of your body is well designed. You just see your eyes, your nose, your, you know, uh, you, you see internal organs, liver, heart, brain, kidney. Just meditate. The one who has created your body, this one is the same one has created this universe. So we are part of universe. He, you can say God or creator or scientific force. There is some force. You cannot deny this. Cannot deny this. And each part of our body has some purpose. Even this hair of eyebrow has some purpose. Your beautiful eyes, so beautiful camera, your digestive system, such a beautiful, uh, you know, uh, your beautiful factory where so many uh, digestive or so many works. Now, when you see that hand is similar to human body and we confirm, we understand with so many similarity, then we confirm Just a moment. So now, if he has created this similarity, it is not by chance. Yes? Then what is the intention of the creator? Why he created this similarity? It means he had great plan. Otherwise, he could have created different shape. So many patterns. Out of so many designs and patterns, he selected this pattern that, and he created hand exactly similar to human body. So it means he has some great purpose. We should understand his intention. You all are doctors or in future, you will become healer. Even if you heal one person, you come in category of healer. This is really great uh, beauty you are opening. You have most wonderful beauty inside. And then if we are using any healing system, either we are using uh, allopathy, Ayurveda, or there are so many healing system uh, on this earth. And all healing systems are beautiful, wonderful. But do you know? why this healing system is working sometimes we say that my this healing system is good or this is good or that is good okay but 
all these healing systems are working because he has implanted this beautiful system inside you and your this inner system is responding to all healing systems it is your inner system which is responding to outer healing systems you cannot say that my therapy is good or that therapy is good it is our healing system in our body yes each cell has healing system your each part we have so many correspondent points we have you know in our body head ear arms legs your trunk if you study all healing systems you will understand that there is not just one healing system there are many healing system yes so it means each part of our body is full of healing vibrations is full of his blessings is full of his grace what we are doing when we are doing any treatment we are just knocking that gate or we are knocking the latent healing system inside us so out of all healing system you have to experience out of all healing system professor park jevo studied everything you know in this journey he he discovered beautiful oracle system oracle correspondence head correspondence system tongue tongue uh, correspondence system nose correspondence system face correspondence system arms correspondence system legs correspondence system and everything professor park jay who touched all systems all systems then finally he realized and because he was also studying oriental medicine he touched tcm he touched all ayurvedas and homeopath and all medical world so what he was trying to understand because also he had this consciousness that he is very simple he is everywhere he is inside your cell in your head in your chest in your abdomen now which way is easy so that you can open his grace and then professor park jay would realized that sujuk is the most simplest and most nearest which can tap or which can knock this healing system very quickly and this is the proof you see this is the proof out of so many healing system in our body when you see the hand 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 is so close to human body so similar to human body this is not by chance two legs with the same joint two arms with same joint and then thumb with same joint this is not by chance so then professor park jevo understood then what is the spirit behind our hand expresses the spirit of love you know today if you see left and right up and down you are sitting in one room yes and see so many things in your room and you will understand behind all these things there are hands behind so many hands are behind all these beautiful discoveries beautiful you can see all material things whatever you are using now in your home outside you open the door of the car there is hand someone has used his hand of course mind is also there intelligence is there but then hand with the help of hand your intelligence is taking shape so it means in 
every discovery, whether it is outside or inside, hands are there. It means if hand is everywhere, it is universal. Anything which is universal, it means he is directly involved. He is directly involved. So we should not just take it by chance. Many people study this correspondence system. Today you will see there are so many YouTube channels where you study Sujok, internet and books. But behind that, you have to catch the spirit. You have to understand the creator. To become best healer, you should know your body correctly. Not just as technical tool that this is leg, this is arm, this is eyes. I know perfectly. If you want to understand and if you want to become best healer, you have to first understand his spirit why he invented or why he discovered this, why he has created hands similar to human body, because he want to help us. As Professor Park Devo always used to say in seminar, that why he created hands similar to human body, because he want to help us. And why he want to help us, because he loves us. And why he loves us? Because we are his sons and daughters. So this hand has that motherly spirit, love spirit. He has given this beautiful healing system and we are ignorant. Even if you know, but still we haven't used 100% but even if you understand 20 percentage is good enough but quality of understanding is important when you compare with the quantity of knowledge you may have lots and lots of knowledge but if you don't understand the spirit then the effect the result is not coming to that level so we touched many things yesterday. We learned face, neck, chest, abdomen points. We know now joints. We know legs, arms. After finding the correct point, the main uh, thing which I told yesterday and I want to say again. Yes, after reaching the correct point, you should stimulate properly. Stimulation is very important. After reaching the point, if you just fix the seed, then the result is not coming. First, find the correct point. And secondly, after reaching the correct point, before putting seed, you should stimulate correctly at least for two minutes. If patient has any pain symptom, then time of stimulation depends on his response, how he is responding to your treatment. If pain is removed in one minute, then you can stop the stimulation. And after that, you will put seed. In all pain symptoms, if point is correct, yes, then, then pain will be reduced for sure. And after you stimulate, if still pain is not reducing, then it means this point is not correct. And you have to go to, you have to search another point. And then your journey is not finished here. Your responsibility is not finished here. Once pain is reduced, you are putting seat and then you have to press that seed several times and you have to guide your patient that at least four times a day, you have to press the seed four times. Yes, because you have to create curative waves and these curative waves are coming when you're pressing that point. 
don't leave this point like this. Otherwise, the result is not coming. So this is very, very important. Yes. So this, uh, that is why I wanted to emphasize this after finding point. You fix the seed and then stimulate from time to time. And now I want to focus the main instrument. Yes, the main instrument in our sujok. So there are uh, many tools we are using and these are surface applicator. After finding the point, we are fixing seeds or magnets or we are doing acupuncture on that point. But the seeds are very commonly used, easily available and also it is very effective. And also, this is really great research of Professor Park Chebu. He touched this beauty that seed can cure. Seed can cure us. And these seeds are working like wonders on your correspondent points. We have beautiful seeds, colorful seeds. And this seed has life. Seed has soul, mind, body, and life. But this seed is so powerful. This one seed, it looks very small, but it has information of big tree. Actually, we are breathing plant world and with each inhale, plant world is coming inside. We breathe in what the trees breathe out and they breathe in what we breathe out. This is so beautiful design. Can you imagine that whenever you are breathing, now, in this moment, realize this. I'm breathing and you are breathing. You are taking oxygen inside. And from where this oxygen is coming, yes, plant world has great contribution in this, in this pattern. So that is why if you are breathing in, don't forget that. You are breathing plant world inside. It means plant world is inside you in each sector of your body. That is why when you are using plant world for treatment, it is giving amazing result. And plants have the spirit of this giving. That is why plants are always giving, always giving. So this beauty was understood by Professor Park J. Fu. As a result, he developed this system. He experimented and then he reached the conclusion that seeds are wonderful tools in Sujok world. Because we are, uh, because we are learning treatment system and we should know, we should understand that which tool is most appropriate in our treatment system. So there is few lines. I'm reading few lines from Professor Park Chevu's book. Each plant or plant world is talking to you. Every tree, bush, and every herb, all the mosses agreed to treat man. Plant says, I shall come to the aid of man when he will call me. Thus appeared medicine. And if it happens that the doctor does not know that medicine to prescribe to the patient, the spirit of plants will whisper it softly, softly in doctor's ears. Such a beautiful message. Plant has soul and mind, body, life. It means if you just use seed and don't worry about difficult disease, even it is cancer, you see, 
but soul of seed knows your loving touch the sense of gratitude towards seed will create the most beautiful healing so that is why when we are using seeds we are having the sense of gratitude because seed is taking the disease energy and giving its own life energy this is so beautiful tool in sujok world one seed yes one seed can create many life each seed as a as you know is soul mind body life and this seed has information of previous generation and also this seed has information of next generation such a big tree this one seed can create it is not not by chance that is why when we are using seed therapy we have to be aware we have to understand the beauty of seed seed has soul just this beautiful awareness can enhance the beauty of your seed each seed has immense power when you touch seed before doing treatment you should be with the sense of gratitude so before you do seed therapy you should make sure that you find painful point and with the help of uh, probe and in emergency if you don't have probe you can also use toothpick or matchstick yes and after stimulating that point you will fix seed with the plaster as i told you that you should press seed from time to time for beginners in case the painful point is not found then after reaching that area but because in that area there are many points so don't worry if you don't find painful point at least do something of course yes finding painful point is very very important but in case you are telling your friend on phone if she couldn't find the correct point because she doesn't know so joke at least you can tell her to cover that area with few seeds if couldn't reach that one point so you have to tell your patient that keep these seeds at least for 7 to 8 hours especially in chronic cases minimum 6 hours maximum it can stay for 12 hours 20 hours also because seed doesn't have any side effect next day you should change and you should put new seeds so now seeds uh, when you warm up the skin now before fixing the seed it is very very important that you warm up the skin so when you are stimulating after finding the painful point when you are stimulating this this skin becomes warm and pink okay don't create new pain for patient don't create any wound when this and you should know the threshold also so when this skin becomes pink color warm that time you should fix the seed when the seed is interacting with the warm surface this energy of seed is uh, it starts radiating it is increased and then seed energy is received by this point that is why warming up of this point stimulating this point is very very important some people i see they just find point and just fix seed so it is not correct you should warm up that point and then fix the seed now now in sujo we are using shape criteria and also property criteria there are two methods so as you see in nature there are so many varieties of seeds and it is really wonder that in our body 
we have organs and these organs you will find the similar shape in the nature similar similar shape seeds in the nature for example you see kidney organ in this nature kidney beans resembles kidney organ buckwheat seed triangular seed matches with the lung when you see the brain walnut is matching with the brain this is great wonder and pancreas matching with the grape seed very beautiful shape and i with the black paper so this is shape criteria so when you are fixing the seed we are keeping this thing in our mind because of this similarity principle when two things are similar as i explained yesterday when two things are similar there is very good energy exchange between two uh, these two components yes so that is why when we are using seed therapy we are keeping this thing in our mind shape same shape yes so this shape is also not by chance if you see kidney beans this is not by chance this is all creator's great purpose and then there is property criteria what is that that some seeds have warm character warm property some seeds have cool property like this so sometimes if person has some inflammation or some hyper uh, activity in any organ this is hyper hyper yes so in this you can use cool character seed seed which has cool property and if person has uh, some chronic disease then in this you can use some uh, hetero kind of seed or i will say some warm character seed like chili black pepper like this so we are using seed and we are keeping these things in our mind one is shape and second is property so there are uh, also few seeds which have neutral character and these are fenugreek seeds and green lentil green gram so this these two colors yellow color green color uh, according to tri origin this is neutral color also so you can use these two seeds uh, in any disease a uh, fenugreek seed we prefer uh, on the yang surface these fenugreek seeds are flat so that it can stay on the yang surface but this yin surface is fleshy area for this uh, yin surface we need dense seed solid seed so that we can press the point and it uh, we can deeply press the point and can give pressure but fenugreek seed on the yang surface is very good except for kidney for kidney we are using kidney beans so these two seeds for yang and yin uh, don't worry in uh, some situation if you don't uh, find any shape cr criteria related seed like this you can use these seeds but just start treatment and don't stop so also sometimes we are using leaves yes leaves like Uh, this is you know basil leaf tulsi so this leaf is so good uh, when some uh, if you have cold cough like this also in your home if you have cold and cough you are using this, uh, this leaf in your tea so it is very good also if um, there is sputum sputum inside then in that case we can use the direction also i will teach you later uh, in practical we can use this direction also direction of leaf also and then we can use mustard seeds for this congestion cold cough yes with the help of uh, first massage the area of lung and then you can grind this mustard and don't grind very fine we don't uh, we need grainy type of powder and not very fine powder mix it with honey and after doing good massage on the lung point you with the help of some good tape yes you can take some bandage and you can fix this on the lung area 
so this has medicinal property also it is very good if person has cold and congestion on the points of lungs and also we are using different leaves in our treatment system yes later you will understand and we are using directions uh, when we are using this leaf we are using direction also so we can discuss later if we have time we can discuss this and but we are focusing now on seeds also we are using the st stalks of bamboo you can see this and uh, here there are some plants resembling the shape of spine so the twigs of fern you see this is resembling the spine when you see your vertebra it is really matching like this and that is why you can use on the joints also spine also and here the fern yes also fern fern it is just matching with your uh, you know ribs you can see ribs very good uh, matching with your thoracic spine with the ribs so we are using this on correspondence system now this leaf is not giving any pressure so don't expect that pressure is coming from this leaf but we are using its energy and here this is insect system in finger system this is spine it, because this is finger therapy you are learning now hand system and also there is another system that is called finger system and if we have time we can study finger system also so on finger system we are using this is for spine disease yes some degeneration some weakness of spine this kind of application will energize your spine and you see like property as i told you property any plant if plant secretes white milk its seed can be applied to increase the quantity of milk in nursing mothers so this is how we are using this seed soya bean you know soya bean seed so after massaging uh, for lactation to improve lactation in the points of breast yes which is located in the chest area here after doing good massage also uh, in sujo we are using uh, massage techniques also we have pressing techniques we are doing zigzag massage and also we are doing clockwise and anti clockwise massage so if you want to increase energy in any part then just to clockwise just to clockwise massage and then on that point you can fix the c clockwise massage means to open the energy to expand the energy and if you want to reduce energy then you can do anti clockwise but if you don't know uh, if you don't know whether to increase or decrease then you can just do pressing technique and after pressing technique after doing good massage you can fix the seat and uh, for eye disorder head and memory glands problem we can use round seed as you know that uh, this is round shape in insect system in finger therapy we can use this as per the size of correspondence area we can pick up the seed big size or small size like this we can choose rice is very good on the points of lung rice is very good for bronchitis bronchial asthma this rice uh, after doing massage and with the help of micropore tape yes paper tape and use very good quality tape this is micropore tape so that your skin can breathe your don't use cello tape or plastic tape use micropore tape and then you can fix these rice rice on the points of lung in case of bronchitis or bronchial asthma walnut very good for brain so this walnut is big size so you can cut after doing massage you should put this walnut in case of uh, Uh, weak memory or any brain disease migraines headaches sometimes this is not giving acupressure so you can combine what i am doing it that sometimes i want to interact with the energy of seed and sometimes i have to give just pressure we have to give pressure so when uh, you have to combine both 
So one day you use this, if you're treating brain disease on the brain point, you apply that seat, which is giving good pressure. Yes, like uh, you can use that uh, green gram. Uh, and on that point, you can use, you can, because this seat with this um, seat, you can press this point very nicely. And then second day, you can use this walnut seat. So because this walnut has loops just like brain. So this, because of the similarity, this walnut application of walnut on the brain point, it is uh, exchanging the energy. So this is just energy exchange, but it is not giving any pressure. So all brain diseases, this is excellent treatment, uh, combined treatment pressure one day and second is just walnut application on the brain point and on mentally retarded children, yes? And insomnia or some, you know, some heaviness in the head, any disease of brain, uh, use this. But don't forget to find the painful point. When you find the painful point, that time you have to fix some solid seed on that point. And then another day, you can fix this. So you can do alternate like this, alternate days. Flex seeds, flex seeds are very good in uh, chronic bronchitis. So these seeds have a lot of thick juice. That is why these seeds are used for decreasing inflammatory process. So this is very good seed. So if inflammation, you can use this flex seeds on the points of lungs. Now, what picture you see here, this is finger, finger system, because our hand is similar to human body. And also we have independent system finger where finger is representing full body. So even if you don't know finger therapy, at least just catch this idea. This is middle phalange. And in middle phalange, you can apply these flex seed because on the hand, this is big territory. So you are using many seeds. So finger system is very good. And, uh, and participants who have a knowledge of this system, they can use just one or two or four flex seeds in mini system, lung point, excellent treatment. So, then, now, Chinese lemon seeds are very good in increasing or work increase, it increases working capacity or decreases mental and physical fatigue. You can see the place, the area, and very good to fix this seed. And uh, this is the area of medulla ob oblongata. Here you have to fix the seed and they boost the activity of cardiovascular and respiratory centers. Very good seed. So that is why now you have to store seed, but when you're storing seed, uh, you should keep these seeds in natural temperature, especially lemon seed, you cannot store. It is better if you use fresh seed because the citrus uh, fruit seeds, they don't have long life. Better if you have a, a situation, some, you know, if you are storing, for example, apple seed, or these green gram or fenugreek seed, these are okay, these you can store, but fresh fruit seed, better if you have chance, try to use fresh. And if you are storing, then um, just keep it for two, three days, four days, or maximum one week, but better to use a fresh seed. So, so seeds of blueberries have estrogen properties can be used in diarrhea by placing them on large intestine and small intestine correspondence area. So this is finger system. And then jeera, cumin seed. This cumin seed is very good. Uh, it can be used in gas problem and distended stomach. So, and this cumin seed is available in everyone's kitchen. So very easily available. And after doing some massage, you just fix these seeds in this intestine area and you will see the change. Better to use in finger system because this is small area. Actually, both systems are excellent. Only thing is area is small. 
So uh, you can use a little uh, small uh, seed or few seeds in this small area. But both systems are excellent system. But if you don't know finger system, then you use your main system. So wild rose seed is bile expelling uh, agent can be used in hepatitis. And also you can use green gram seed for liver. If you don't find this seed, you can use green gram seed. Oat seed on gallbladder point, it is very good for bile congestion. Okay, so all these seeds and now you have to do survey also now not only these seeds because there are so many seeds in nature and each seed has some quality and if if you are in herbal medicine world or if you are you know lover of plant world you know some properties of plants and seeds all those beautiful properties whatever you know you can use in uh, your healing system for example you see ginger and garlic all these things have medicinal properties so if there is any inflammatory process these are uh, have it these seeds are working like antibiotics black pepper yes garlic and ginger like this so uh, seeds of pomegranate are used in hearing and vision disorders also rice, as I told you, in bronchitis and bronchial asthma, barley, barley in hemorrhoid and gout, flax seed, because flax seeds are, have lots of oil inside. So it is very good in constipation and toothache. So this is how you can use this beauty of seed in your treatment system. And then... Uh, people, those who know six key, they can use uh, properties, they can focus properties of seed and also they can focus color of seed. For example, green color seeds uh, represent wind energy. So if you need wind energy in any part, you can fix this green seed. Red color represents heat energy. Orange color represents hotness energy. Anyway, so these are... Uh, the seeds ha also have uh, representation of six energies, but for bigness, I can give uh, some glue, bright shining seeds, yes, bright color seeds, shining, se uh, shining seeds, round seeds, and bright, when I say bright color, it means green color, red color, orange color, bright color seeds, all bright color seeds you can use a chronic problem. If there is any chronic problem, yes, degenerative process, uh, some, you know, uh, stones, you, you need hetero, you need very active seed, you need warm character seed. So in all uh, cirrhosis, yes, cirrhosis, or any kind of homo disease, chronic disease, old disease, after finding the painful point, you can fix that bright color seed on that point. But if person has inflammatory process, some inflammation or acute condition, then uh, on that point, you should use dull color seed like brown color, gray color, like this, pale colors, dull colors. But it doesn't mean that you use that seed which is destroyed. Seed should be healthy even if you're using pale color uh, because seed is giving energy. Only thing is colors. So you, uh, beginners can keep two things in mind. All bright shining colors you can use for chronic cases and pale colors, dull colors you can use for acute hyperactivity uh hyper functions this is use of cumin seed yes like in atonic uh constipation this uh, application of this cumin in the area of large intestine is very good also energy points green peas 
we will touch this subject today also this subject uh, after massaging after massaging this or after doing moksha you can fix this green pea seed and this seed has lots of energy and this area is these points i will teach you so these points are very very important points which are interacting with your outer environment which is also interacting with the universe so we are opening the door of this point and uh, after doing massage moksha when fix this seed we can uh, enhance our energy and we will focus this subject in detail so reducing spasm reducing spasm yellow oval wrinkled uh, sweet taste seeds so this improves lymph flow and for gb and kidney stone also this seed is very good so this is calf area you know in your uh, basic system middle phalange of uh, middle two fingers this is your uh, calf area and here you are using yellow color seed next also you see these are the seeds uh, also we are using uh, the directional from directional point of view also we are using these seeds so seeds have direction let me explain this i will explain you with my drawing now because these are very very effective very very effective just a moment okay just a moment see we can use directional energy also in fruit seed and grain seed so this is uh, let's understand the energy flow in seed for example this is shape of apple seed like this yes so in this seed there is energy flow there is a pattern energy is moving from pointed to broad how do you understand that energy is coming from this point you see when you see this apple cut this apple you will see seed pointed part is attached with the mother this point like this you see so it means this seed energy is coming from this area yes so when we understand this we can apply this seed in intestine area yes so in constipation in constipation we can fix seed like this from narrow to broad now uh, in fruit seed there is different rule and in grain seed opposite so this is like pushing energy like this narrow to broad narrow to broad this is how we are using this seed in case of diarrhea we can use opposite opposite like this now same way if lungs yes breathing problem now breathing means oxygen should come down from top to down 
oxygen should come down. So how you will put the seed? If you understand this pattern, then how you will put seed like this? Yes, one on nose, we can see on hand. This is thumb. Neck. And this is your chest, yes? So here, also sometimes nose blockage, just one application of apple seed is opening your nose. Simple, simple, simple tools, but it is really giving great result. So now windpipe, this is windpipe. From narrow to broad, from narrow to broad. Okay. See. Like this. Narrow to broad like this because energy is coming from narrow to broad so we are pushing but in case if person has exhaling problem or this person needs to throw sputum out yes sputum out then you have to put opposite opposite like this see then is in this case you are putting opposite. It means like this or exhaling problem. So if you understand the direction you can use in many patterns. But here I want to inform that when you are looking a uh, grain seed Energy flow is different in grain seed. In fruit seed, energy is from narrow to broad because this, this is the origin point. This is the narrow point which is touching the mother. And in wheat, if you see wheat plant, wheat plant, in this broad part is touching the source and this pointed part is away from the source. So broad part, Touching, so in this pattern, energy flow is like this. So if you are using grain seed, you have to keep this this thing in your mind. Okay, so uh, if your intention is to, mm, to push energy in some direction, like in intestine or in, uh, in this, uh, lung you can use and also when you study your energy flow meridian sujoki on if you want to increase energy in meridian sometimes this information you can use on meridians also if you don't have bar magnet you can use this you can make chain you can make chain like this this is meridian yes this is meridian and if you know that energy is flowing from you know leg to arm so now I'm not touching Meridian because this is our uh, correspondence system class. But I'm giving you a glimpse that this information, if you have done Meridian, you have Meridian knowledge, you can use this system. Seed therapy beautifully for tonification or sedation of Meridian. Okay. So. Um, again my screen so you see this is buckwheat seed buckwheat seed so you can use this seed buckwheat seed uh, any kind of inflammation inflammation or hyperactivity this buckwheat seed is very good and uh, all seed, because in 6K, also, again, this, this information is related to 6K. Uh, after understanding the property of seeds, you will come to know in coming time later, uh, in advanced classes, we can discuss that a six, the seed also has this kind of property. And 
as per our energy diagnosis, we can use these seeds. If we need heat energy or dryness energy or hotness energy like this. So anyway, uh, this is just a glimpse, but you can use this seed like U UTI. Yes, UTI, inflammation of the urinary bladder, simple one buckwheat seed you can use here on the point of bladder. Yesterday you saw point of bladder, you know this, you remember? This I told you already from narrow to broad. You see here is the apple and narrow part is touching the mother uh, skin. So energy is flowing from narrow to broad in apple seed. You can see here seed of the fruit. So why I'm showing you this slide so you understand that there is particular kind of energy flow and energy flow is coming from the part, this part, this narrow part, because it is touching the skin, okay? And seed therapy to clean the lung from sputum, as I told you, you can fix seed like this. Once you understand that energy is coming from narrow to broad, and then you can use this pattern on the lungs also. And here, this seed, this black color dot, you should focus. Yes, this black, that is why whenever you are using seed, uh, you have to know actually the origin point of that seed from where energy is coming. Don't just pick it randomly. As I told you, if you, because apple seeds, you all know, you can cut and see. Wheat seed also, you should know. But there are so many seeds without knowing that origin point, you don't use those seeds. So this, in this seed, this is black color. This target black color is the origin point and energy is coming from black to up. Now to throw sputum, yes, to, to throw sputum, see, Just a moment. So we need this kind of action. Down to up. Yes, down to up. That is why black dot is down. Down to up like this. You, you can fix seed like this on main system or finger system. And here you see this is seeds of the cereal. As I told you, this in this broad part is touching the... Uh, source, that is why in wheat seed, energy flow is from broad to narrow. This is seed therapy in case of obesity. Yes, but uh, don't think that just doing the seed therapy and uh, you are not taking, if you're not doing any exercise and if you're not making your, maintaining your, your eating habit, and even if you do so joke, it is not working. You have to do both things. You have to focus your lifestyle. Along with that, if you're doing the seed therapy, then you will see great change in your body. Very fast, you will improve. So now uh, obesity, obesity, it means generally you are eating more. Okay, you are eating more. And that is why we, we focus this criteria that you should close mouth so that uh, your appetite is reduced. Closing mouth means reducing appetite and to prevent constipation. It means close upper section and open down section so that uh, it comes out. Nothing is stored inside you. So for this purpose, we are using this seed. Same principle, same principle you see this seed. This black dot here, see here, this is black dot like this. Means, you see, this is your face. This is your mouth, okay? And it means down. Sorry, with computer, it is difficult to draw, but anyway, you can understand.
this is origin point. So it is showing this direction. Means food should not come inside. It means decreasing appetite. Yes, if person has um, want to eat again and again, again and again, even this person is slim and but eating again and again is not good. So you can put this seed in this direction. And also we can use this, um, as I told you, twig also. Twig also. Now, how to decrease diet now? Now you can use apple seed also. Maybe I will show you big. Yeah, this picture is big. You can see here. Narrow to broad is energy flow. If narrow to broad is energy flow, so each seed has this direction now, like this. It means up. Food should not come inside. If you have this kind of energy pattern in your digestive tube, you will not feel hungry. Yes, and you will not eat more. Of course, you will eat for your survival, but you will not eat extra. So this is how you are using these seeds and also you can use twigs. Opposite. Now this plant also you see, you have to see actually any twig you can use. Simple criteria is that you should see uh, from where uh, the energy is coming. Where is the source point? This is the source point. That is why energy is going like this. So if you fix this twig like this, again, yes, this is your mouth. This is your mouth. It means go back to mouth. Don't come inside. So we don't want this energy coming down. Opposite. So if you see the before plucking this twig, just uh, see from where energy is coming out. And with some marker pen, you can mark this area so that when you are using on correspondent point, you know it, where is the source? Yes, where is the source like this? So this is a uterine prolapse. The, again, if prolapsed uterus, prolapsed uterus, it means energy is flowing like this, narrow to broad. So what we have to do it, we want to uplift, uplift uterus, so you see this kind of application. After doing some massage down to up, our intention is down to up, okay? This we have done. And here this is uh, to lower blood pressure. Now to lower blood pressure, black color on all fingertips. And then on one hand, you can do color therapy. On the other hand, you can uh, fix these seeds, buckwheat seed, as I told you, this buckwheat seed is brown and black color. And for all hyper activities, you can use this seed. But at the same time, I want to tell you that this is emergency treatment. The moment when you have blood pressure, you are doing this treatment and it will help you but it doesn't mean that this is final treatment. You have to take care of, again, I will say, of many other things, yes? Stress and diet and lifestyle. Okay. okay. So, mm, we because you see, we are learning uh, systems and if we don't know our tools, we cannot. After knowing the points, we have to uh, use these tools also. We should know tools also. Yesterday we covered front system, yes? And now we will touch back, back, spine. So I will share my screen just a moment. And one thing I want to tell you here, we are talking about disease, disease, disease. And then we are focusing that when there is disease, then you have to find painful point. And after finding painful point, you have to fix seed and disease is cured. But I want to tell one more important point of Professor Pal Chivu. He said, why there is disease? 
why disease is in large intestine, why disease is in brain, or why disease is in liver? Because your brain is not smiling. Your liver is not smiling. You see, Professor Park Chewu started his journey from Sujo. This Sujo is so wonderful, so miraculous. Many people on this earth have experienced the beauty of Sujo. Then, in this evolution journey of Professor Park Jevu, after Sujok, he touched tri origin, and then in his last days, he touched smile. Then, each progressive step is more evolved, is more evolved. And each next step is more superior than previous step. So if Sujok can give wonderful result, then what about next step? Please think. Professor Park Chewu, after doing many, many researches and he developed many technical tools and many technical techniques to help, but then final destination is smile meditation. Someday we need to touch that also because why disease has come? We are not smiling. Externally, we have good smile. We have social smile, but internally, we are not smiling. And this has big meaning. The smile subject is big, big subject. And then, story is not finishing here. Okay, agree, I'm not smiling, but why I'm not smiling? Then this is the point, why I'm not smiling? There is some reason why I'm not smiling. Why you are not smiling? There is some reason. So Professor Park Chewu worked on cause also. Professor Park Chewu worked on root also. And then in his this evolution, when he was searching most simplest healing tool, he reached the final conclusion. Of course, Sujok is also required. Sujok is treating the effect. Please understand this point. There is cause and also there is effect. Sujok is treating effect only. So many doctors are practicing on this earth. So many doctors, what they are doing, they are treating the effect. Ask yourself, you all are working in clinics. Maximum people are doctors here. Why disease is coming back again? High blood pressure, diabetes. How are you treating? Are you treating locally or you are treating or until his last breath, he is dependent on you. If you are real doctor, then you will make him free. You will make him independent. There are so many patients on this earth. Don't worry. There are many patients are coming. Quickly, you have to make him free. This is your task. That is why we need to work on effect and also we need to work on cause. Time will come, people not understanding now, but time will come. And once you heal cause, naturally effect is gone. But because our mind, ask logic, needs more technical tools, need more logical tools, that is why dependent on these techniques. So just final thing I want to tell you because we are studying technique. Very simple tip. Though smile subject is big subject, you know. If we study smile, smile meditation, as I told you, Professor Pal Jevu had scientific mind. He introduced subject after doing great researches scientifically. Smile meditation, he introduced 
with scientific with logics and he introduced great science because this physical world is scientific world technical world and also raw material has come from metaphysical world so metaphysical world is also scientific only thing is we cannot see invisible means it is not absent it is there only thing is we cannot see we all are learning this science why you are here always you should have purpose if you are attending any class just for fun sake just you want to see what is happening in the class or you want to learn something why or you are just learning to heal your eye disease or knee pain or ankle pain or lumbar pain this is your local purpose if you have big purpose then you know why i am here our body we are learning healing system yes our body is just one percentage whatever you see skin muscle bone blood is just one percentage but our inner world is 99 percentage we say that we are composed of soul mind body and life soul is metaphysical mind is metaphysical life is metaphysical body is physical body when i say physical world this is just part of atom world and if you are curing or if you are focusing liver or stomach it means just body it means you are just focusing physical world this physical world has disease it means it means mind is also here mind is also suffering here each cell is composed of soul mind body and life if we are healers we have to understand this that we are just healing with with this technique we are just healing body we are just repairing atom world we are just repairing one percentage but what about 99 percentage so just simple tip smile more smile more and understand that disease has come before taking physical shape it has crossed the door of metaphysical world and then it has come to you now so if you want to heal yourself permanently you should open all the knots in metaphysical world human being is blessed only human being can open this knots we have come on this earth in the form of human being is itself a great blessing is is itself a great miracle only human being can understand what is metaphysical world if he is open to understand so be ready next time maybe we will talk about this 99 percentage world next time you will get invitation to study this subject yes so let's come back with smile you are treating yourself with smile you are handling your patient so first you should smile if you want to give if you want to give healing to your patient okay so now i will focus spine when i am free teaching this treatment pattern i always focus and i i want to push you that pay attention to your metaphysical world also so this is bone here you know bone here 
yesterday we made central line yes so we had seven uh, cervical vertebra this protrusion of bone because in picture you cannot see so this protrusion of bone here this is c1 and here there is one more bone this bone this is c7 okay c1 and this is c7 now between this because we have seven cervical vertebra c1 c1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so if person has any cervical problem yes and if you have medical report then very precisely you can go each vertebra yes you can check one by one if you know correct vertebra for example c2 c3 problem then you know this is the area general area general idea you should have then you have to check one by one and then i want to inform you uh, when you are using this probe you should hold perpendicular straight and while searching point yes and then give pressure one by one now this is yang side this is yang side that is why don't give very deep pressure yes and one by one with patients you have to check if patient says that i don't feel a uh, pain actually you have to uh, press little deep but not very deep keep this uh, threshold that borderline in your mind of patient so if person says that my all points are painful then you have to decrease the pressure so one by one you will check 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 now if you don't have probe now then you can use toothpick back side of toothpick also you can use and also you can use matchstick or something like this but these days this probe is very easily available in your these acupressure shops and wherever you find point yes you can just put mark like this so that you know that this is the main point here after finding the painful point you should massage this area this is the correct format of treatment don't uh, be in a hurry after finding uh, finding point and immediately don't uh, put seed so massage this area nicely and you can pause also because sometimes patient cannot tolerate this continuously a continuous massage but at least at least this point needs a 2 minutes pressure for good result 2 minutes pressure okay here so after this person has cervical problem because this is a routine disease now you can use this seat see white dot this is green gram white dot will touch the skin now you know that energy will radiate from this white dot so this is the pattern i am teaching you on cervical but 
you can use this pattern in any correspondent point. Only thing is white dot should touch the skin. So main point is this. For example, don't forget your main point. Yes, you should make sure that your seed is attached here. OK, so these are all surrounding points. And my main seed is touching this main point and rest are surrounding seeds. After doing two minutes continuous massage, you can tie this and press, press, press. Okay, so uh, first pressing doctor should do like this for two minutes. After this, application you should press for two minutes and then you should give homework to your patient and tell him to press this uh, three to four times in a day sometimes you will see just one sitting is enough finished many in my experience then many many cases acute cases just one sitting is good enough but if chronic then you have to pay attention and if you don't get painful point here, then you have to check thumb. And, uh, and if you don't get here, then you can go to big toe also. So this is cervical area and we have 12 thoracic vertebra. So T1, this is T1 and here is T8. Because of this tilting of thumb, because in body, this is straight line, but in hand, this is tilting of thumb. So on the level of T8, yes, this is finishing here. And this is the bone here. You can feel this is bone. Here T8 is finishing. T1, T8. T1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. Generally, you will get patient of cervical and lumbar. And then when you come to this section, this is T8 and here is T9. Okay. Now you divide this. This line into three parts. Three equal parts. So one, two, three. Now this is T9, then T10, equal distance T11 and T12. T10, T9, T10. Okay, this is, wait. T10, T11, just a moment. Yes, so this is nine, nine, ten, ten, eleven, and twelve. Okay, then lumbar, lumbar five vertebra, one, two, three, four, five. So this is lumbar area, and then sacrum five, this is fused. One, two, three, four, five, five. And this last part is your tailbone. Okay. Now, uh, you in your daily routine, you will find lumbar and cervical cases. Okay. 
so lumber lumber you can use green trees or dry trees this is yellow but good to use green or you can use black pepper okay so this is the point here yes in this area this is the point massage this area nicely and you should use good quality tape micropore so that your skin can breathe and good if you use this cutter like this you can fix it here yes and then you should tell your patient to press many times a day many times a day but before doing seed therapy you have to do a uh, massage first and then fix seed okay and here is your lumber after lumber this is sacrum region and here is your tailbone so for tailbone pain for tailbone pain it is good if you fix seed black pepper if uh, area is fleshy you should use dense seed solid seed so here tailbone you can fix it like this like this okay and press press nicely okay now kidney here on the back side kidney is located <clears throat> on the level of excuse me on <clears throat> on the level of t12 from t12 to lumbar 2 yes so uh, you see these are kidney beans you should have general idea because this seed is big size and it will uh, automatically cover this area though left kidney is up and right kidney is down in body but this seed is uh, will cover that up and down no, don't worry about uh, up left kidney up and right kidney down because of this big size it will naturally cover the area so here again okay you can use this broad tape also now these white two dots of kidney bean should face each other between t12 and you see this is t12 the web it is touching like this when you are doing for patient it is very neat work but now i am doing on my hand so t12 between t12 and lumbar 2 
and on the top of kidneys there are adrenal glands also and the size of this kidney bean is big it is automatically touching adrenal gland also and these adrenal glands are very important we are uh, treating in all emotional cases yes very very important adrenal gland okay and now another thing is okay before i go next let me check so i hope you have understood are you with me chat box let me see because i should know whether you are understanding or not okay good <clears throat> good once you <clears throat> understand big framework then don't worry you will get many videos and uh, immediately you can see that video and you can start treatment here in this class in this short webinar i'm focusing main framework and then uh, you will get many disease related videos after that good thank you for your response <clears throat> okay now yes i want to touch energy points now <clears throat> let us see the picture <clears throat> so now these energy points are very very important points and these energy points are located on central line front central line and back central line so on yin side we have seven energy points and on yang side we have six energy points so these the these points are very special points especially uh, when uh, when person has many diseases multiple diseases and you don't know from where to start then in that case you can start your treatment with energy point and there are many lots and lots of uses of energy point first of all i want to tell you that these energy points uh, you see on central line is not chakra points these are energy point according to higher sciences uh, these in sujo the central line and this uh, front central line and back central line is also representing conception vessel meridian like front line is representing cv meridian conception vessel meridian and back side yang uh, this back yang central line is representing uh, governing vessel so according to uh, eight key these meridians are brightness energy brightness energy related meridian these are royal meridians and this cv meridian yes central line yin side uh, central line this is called cv meridian this is like queen meridian yes this is yin brightness and queen of all meridians that is why treatment on this line can activate your energy and on the yang side this is like king meridian yes a uh, boss of all yang meridians it can give nourishment to all yang meridians if boss is healthy yes then naturally uh, other uh, lower meridians also will become healthy so in a uh, energy deficiency we are using these points and uh, let us draw first point and then i will explain utility of these points also you can see here first let us see this computer drawing and then i will show you on my hand or on 
just a moment. So, print out. Okay. Okay, let us draw on hand. Straight away, we'll draw on hand. Central line. So first, this is starting and ending point, very easy. Yes. And then find center point of this line, exact center point. And then center of this line. So now uh, after this, when you divide this, then this is lower half and this is upper half in this trunk area. Here again divide into three part. This lower part divide into three part. One, one, two, we have one, two, three. Yes. So this is from lower, this is your center line. Okay, center line. One. So this is your from lower one third. Okay. And then this is upper. So this is your center point. And then this is your lower one third point. And this part also divide into three. One, two, three. We have three points. So from wrist, this is one third. This is an energy point. One, two, three. Okay. And here you already have. So one. This is one number, two number, three number, four, five, six, seven. Okay, line, center. After this, this is lower half, this is upper half. In lower half from down, one third. Upper half from up, one third. And this is chest center line. This is simple top, bottom, center. Okay. And then back side. Here, back side. This one. Center, starting, ending, and center. Bone, three energy point. And then this is very simple. St ending part, and then on the wrist, and exact center. Very simple, yes. Now, because I wanted to show on hand so that you can get the idea. So let, let me share again.
Yes. So as I told you that uh, this is very important, especially in chronic cases, uh, you should do this energy point treatment as first priority. After explanation, I will tell you how to treat. Now you know the points and then how to treat. So this energy point, for example, let us take example. You know, sometimes what happens, patient comes to you with many, many diseases and you don't know how to start treatment. Just do for a few days, just do energy point. Now we have this energy point on left hand, right hand, left foot and right foot also. Here, foot also. You can see though we are using hand energy point more often, but it is very good in chronic cases if you can combine with foot. So if you understand this uh, hand pattern, then exactly on the foot, middle two fingers are legs. This is central line. And big toe, yes, this is big toe, same criteria here also. You have the same line, center, two end point center, and here also two end point center. And inside also, you see this is energy point line here on the heel. Uh, this five number energy point is touching the ankle area, last point where your heel is finishing. And then this is your... Uh, this five number is touching your ankle point and here this is uh, your uh, heel and as you have done first you are finding starting and ending point so number one and number five these are ending point and number three is exact center so between five and one this is exact center and then this is two number from lower one third and four number from this ankle point one third. And this five you can see, five number you can see here, this is just ankle line below ankle line. And here in this chest, this is chest area below big toe. And this is very easy central line starting ending and center point, okay? Now, in chronic cases, it is very good if you combine a uh, hand and foot together. For example, uh, you can take left hand, yes, left hand yin and diagonal, you can go to right foot and you can treat right foot yang energy point. So this is a uh, harmony. This is kind of uh, you are creating neutral power yin and yang because yin side and yang side now you know. So also same on the yang surface, if you're choosing yang surface of hand, then diagonal right foot yin side you can choose. And if you're choosing right hand combination, right hand com combination with left foot, right hand yin side, yes, and left foot yang side, then right hand yang side and left foot yin side. So yin and yang combined. I hope you understand. Also, you can do simple also. Don't make it so complicated. If you can do simple way, you can go ahead. How you will do that? Uh, just uh, one day you just do left hand front and back. Okay. And next day, right foot front and back. Then Next day, right hand front and back, and then left foot front and back. This diagonal combination, simple way. And if you have to choose one hand, okay, for you can start this treatment in female hand, start treatment with right hand. This is called female and male criteria. Uh, for female, choose right hand, and for male, choose left hand. Like this, you can combine your, uh, you can start this treatment. Okay, now, okay. so there are many benefits of these energy points. Uh, if you are tired, yes, if you're tired, you feel weak and you have fatigue symptoms, 
then you can do these energy points and you can at least you should do 15 days 15 days this treatment energy point treatment and if person has chronic diseases any chronic diseases then definitely you should do energy point treatment and in all cases of uh, you know degeneration fibrosis cirrhosis weakness fatigues cancers and if body is cold generally body stays cold you can do this energy point and if person is weak yes and has recovered from some illness of after operations body pains then you can do this energy point treatment And then old people, okay, old people. For old people also, this is very good, very good to do energy point treatment. And uh, if, uh, just a moment. Some uh, organ failure, organ hypofunction, hypothyroid, yes? then you can do energy point treatment. And uh, also, uh, if you want to give relaxation to your body, then also you can do energy point treatment. For example, a uh, lot of work since few days, your mind is busy, your body is busy, and uh, you have tiredness. Not It is not chronic illness, but or uh, there is some marriage in your home, there is some function in your home, and since few days you are working very hard, then you can do this energy point treatment also. It is very good. And uh, also I want to tell if you can do this energy point treatment before sleeping is very good, very good. And this energy point treatment, generally we are treating with moksha. Moksha is excellent technique moksha therapy on energy point to rejuvenate your energy to highlight your energy and then uh, very good especially in insomnia case chronic insomnia also you can do this energy point and before sleeping if you do it it is very good and don't wet your hand after doing this moksha therapy so i want to tell you how to do treatment will show you just a moment i have to burn this moksha just give me one second okay. so this is moksha yes you have to burn this moksha. Actually, we have variety of moksas. We have stick moksha, we have cigar moksha, we have standing moksha, we have thread moksha. There are variety of moksas, but this stick moksha is very common. And this is smokeless moksha. So you can use this. We have sticker moksha also. There are many varieties of moksha. Yes. So this is very commonly used. But if you have that, uh, uh, if you have opportunity, to, opportunity to get there then it is good to keep variety of moksas because if you are working on small point small correspondent point insect system finger system mini system then it is very good to use that thread moksa and sticker moksa small moksa yes so now i'm doing with this moksa because we have short time i cannot introduce all because i want to teach many other things but i am selecting this moksha okay so so after burning this it is good if you keep some spray yes and you should keep your hand like this don't keep hand like this otherwise ash will fall down and you should do like this now 
it is very good to start from down to up because in cv energy flow is from down to up so do like this clockwise on the inside do clockwise moksha and then also how to do moksha is also very important okay you should keep this moksha near the skin don't burn the skin if you burn the skin and if scar is created that instead of tonification or uh, giving energy it is like um, sedation effect is coming because skin scars is like creating poor energy yes poor energy but we want to in increase this energy so pink color skin is okay but uh, mm, scar is not good this is uh, like sedation okay now you should do this moksha come and then go far until the skin becomes warm you should continue this moksha and then come to next point like this clockwise wait then next don't burn the skin till the time patient feel good warmness stable warmness yes not just superficial deep warmness sometimes we are thinking that if we do more 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 moksha it is good for health no this is not like this okay stable warmness and then you can go next like this yes so to save time i'm just introducing on two three points only like this and also you can use this odd and even number also like uh, we are using in sujo male you can do even uh, you can use even number and for female you can use uh, sorry for male you can use odd number and for female you can use even number for example i want to do moksha here yes and now you see it is not warm now i need to create stable heat okay so this is two is even number but if it is not uh, after doing this two time it is not warm then i can do again three time okay now this is heat now i can feel good heat and then four this is even number it depends actually you will see uh, when you are doing moksha you will understand that each point will need uh it is not necessary that four times maybe one time this point becomes warm sometimes doing five times this point is not becoming warm so you end on the even number okay but don't make it complicated i just told you because this is also one of the technique in sujo odd and even but you just go simple simple you see clockwise wait don't take stress wait and then like this oh this is warm now come next don't go next confirm that this is good warm okay warm like this but if you can keep even and odd in your mind this is also okay like this and then you have to go like this yang side also from down to up in chronic cases it is very good we recommend uh this um, yin side energy point and in acute cases we recommend yang side energy point also there is and then you should quench this yes check recheck also we have this sticker moksha it, it this is also very good okay on energy points you can keep this and this is like hollow here you can see this is hollow 
and this is very good this is uh, if you want to penetrate heat inside the point this technique is very good so this is sticker moksha you can use this you can burn this but if person feels patient feels good heat you can immediately remove sometimes even uh, after doing this um, one application patient uh, uh, doesn't feel heat it means he needs more heat so you can fix if uh, this is finished and patient says i am not feeling heat then you after removing this then you can put another like this so this is also there and also there is uh, mini moksha but then uh, i like one more technique very nicely in chronic cases uh, i generally if you can find thread moksha then combine with garlic cut the garlic garlic piece and then insert that mini moksha make hole in the garlic just a moment i can show just a moment garlic this is very good technique if person has cold cough so i'm creating i'm making stand of garlic yes you see this is stand and then make hollow just a moment see hollow stand okay and then this moksha is actually big size we have thread moksha also we have tiny moksha also yes so now uh, i don't have now that moksha but just for sample this is big size okay like this yes so this is uh, this will create deep heat inside the point it will activate this point okay this is also very good technique and then uh, after if person feels warm good warmness then with the help of forceps you can uh, remove this use some tool otherwise you will burn your hand like this so you can use this technique also also you can use on the lung point in cold cough you can use this on lung point and you have to be very careful but then very good now you see this is big size that is why it is not standing here but use because this moksha is not meant for garlic use tiny moksha is also available then you can fix it on mini system also like this so i like this moksha techniques for all cold or cold cough and old diseases and then also not only on energy points you can do this moksha on correspondent point also okay like kidney stones kidney stones and uh, lung lung fibrosis or liver weak liver weak stomach knee pain joints pain you can do this moksha 
And then also in stone technique, we can combine this moksha with the ice massage, with ice and uh, moksha. This is also very good technique. Uh, like in kidney stone, yes, in kidney stone, you can do moksha on kidney points. And this is how stone, because this is a very powerful treatment, and then stone can come to ureter and there is a pathway from ureter, it can come out. And then when you are doing moksha on this kidney points and simultaneously, you should massage ureter points also so that because stone will shift, will come to ureter and then you should uh, further help to move. Stone should move and it should come out, okay? Now, one more point I want to tell you is, when you are making bladder point here, yes, bladder point here, your ureter, kidney, this is kidney. This is the shape in body, okay? So, half part, this lower part, you should stimulate from yin side, and this half part, together with kidney, this part, upper ureter and kidney, you should stimulate from back side. So this part, like this, this part. Okay, because this is deep inside. So this stimulation you can do from here also, like this. You have to imagine like this. So this half part, stimulate from here. So whenever you are doing moksha for kidney stone, Always do this kind of massage with this so that stone should move next, okay? Because this uh, doing moksha on kidney points will push stone and then, and when coming on the yin side, then you push like this and bladder. You know, this is bladder area. That is why this combination is very important like this, downwards, downwards like this. And then I told you, that uh, if, if there is gallbladder stone, in gallbladder stone, there is no exit, yes? So you can, uh, you have to break stone in that area. If it uh, becomes powder form, then it can come. Okay, now this is gallbladder, liver, this is liver here, you know this, and gallbladder is here, and gallbladder is, hidden behind the liver. So you should pressure, uh, do deep pressure. First is find the point, find the point, okay? And you have to check where is the correspondent point, painful point, this is very good technique. And after doing this massage and then stimulation when this is finished and then do moksha. Now, when you do moksha like this, you have to combine this with ice and moksha. How? First, keep ice with you. You can keep ice in polythin, small polythin like this. And uh, we have to combine this moksha and ice. First do moksha. And if this becomes warm, and then you can take ice cube, massage, and don't keep ice on this point. You have to use with the Polythene, you have to keep eyes in the polythene so that your hand doesn't become wet, okay? So this is kind of cold pack, combination of moksha and cold. So moksha, then ice. Again, moksha and ice. Moksha and ice. So this kind of vibration, this is very strong vibration. It can burst the stone, burst the stone like this. So this combination is very good. If you understand this is, you can do it for your patient. But, but very important thing is that you should find painful point. If you don't succeed in finding painful point in left hand, then you should go on the right hand. Important thing is find a point in right or left hand. Sometimes in sex system is also good. Now this moksha therapy you can do if, uh, renal cardiac deficiency, yes, atrophy case, dystrophy case, uh, congestion uh, and the poor circulation, atrophy, dystrophy, shrink kidney like this, 
okay so there are so many things when there is any chronic disease you should use moxa and in my clinical practice whenever a patient is you know uh, has big history chronic history definitely i am going to teach that patient because we don't have time to do moxa every day and then we make sure we teach we we teach patient how to do moxa and then uh, patients are doing on their own okay so you should guide your patient to do moxa how many times we do okay one once in a day one time once in a day okay once in a day so then uh don't wash your hand after doing this warming up don't wash your hand and it is good in cold weather if winters then you can wear gloves you can wear socks like this you can do it and also uh when you are doing moksha please be very sure that don't keep your hand sometimes as a beginner when we are doing moksha we are keeping because of that falling of ashes it can burn the skin so you have to keep your hand like this okay so i'm reading your chat box yes yes so on knee joints also on knee joints also oh i can see bupinder kaur here many bupinder kaur here oh this is not me oh i didn't know that Bup many bupinder kaur your link used for joining okay 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 i hope you have understood these are big points major points and then there are many other things you can understand later okay i will send you many information in groups yes i wanted to convey big uh, bold information and there are so many other things and many videos you will receive and you will understand more deeply and don't worry if you miss anything because this is my routine teaching i keep if you have missed any lecture any part then uh, in future also i'm um, this is my routine work so i'm teaching and you can join my next lecture also in case you missed yesterday or like this okay now next thing next i want to explain now yesterday i told you that i will explain overlapping concept that is very important now okay now very important thing yesterday you have done okay so i am not focusing these drawings i just want to focus overlapping concept you see this Uh, so jo even basic system has many details many details because this is short course so i'm i have picked up i as i told you i have picked up bold points so that you can just start your journey yes otherwise there are so many other things when we are studying uh, academically then we are studying many many things we have but even with this you can start your treatment and you can experience very good results now upper section now we have this three section in abdomen so here is stomach 
you know this is just general idea i want to give because overlapping concept you have done this tomorrow yesterday you have done this so we touched this yes now overlapping concept as i told you yesterday that if you are making abdomen uh, drawings just remove chest parts from your imagination so that you can focus uh, this abdomen area yes now with overlapping concept okay this is thumb left thumb yes this is left thumb okay and this is right thumb hmm now this is face neck chest face neck chest and in left hand now you know below the chest is liver okay this is liver and here sorry 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 this is my mistake i'm sorry again stomach liver okay this is just rough drawing face neck chest and stomach so this is stomach stomach and here face neck chest and liver now please see in left hand chest overlaps some part of digestive system and this is stomach and in right hand chest is overlapping liver so it means if you are pressing this area this is face neck chest and also here is stomach and in this side face neck chest and also this is liver okay this is this is stomach and here this is liver so don't confuse this now in left hand you will see that liver is independent no overlapping is here and in right hand in right hand stomach is independent no overlapping is here don't confuse okay so we have left hand and right hand face neck chest and stomach face neck chest and liver okay now when you study the square part you can understand whether it is left hand or right hand yes when you overlap both hand you will see this square part just focus square part don't see thumb and you will see stomach is both stomach are together and both liver are together no change at all only thumb is changing so you can see like this if this is stomach below the stomach is stomach either you learn this hand or you learn here like this like this okay like this so after you understand this now you know that if you are pressing here this is lung area 
for pressing, for pleating stomach, you should press deeply. Whenever there is overlapping concept, then this organ hidden behind the chest, you have to press deeply. So, but in this hand, stomach is independent. Here, you don't need to press deeply, okay? Like this, you have to keep in your mind. And now I want to focus some practical part because I want you to start treatment. You all should prepare your seed box, yes? Some seeds, magnets like this. You can prepare your seed box with the help of tape. Also tape, scissors. Just a moment. So let's do some practical part. Tape, 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 Now, let's say liver, okay? Just a moment. Now, in left hand, Liver is independent because here, chest and stomach, chest and stomach. So here, liver is independent. So if you're finding liver point, then check, check, check. This is big territory, yes? For example, after searching, this is main point. This is a very sharp point. Then magnets. I can, I will introduce magnet tomorrow. Let us take seeds. Yes. So one seed you can use on the master point. And when you are using seeds, white dot of seed should touch the skin. These are surrounding points, yes, surrounding points. Center point should touch the main point, like this. Don't forget that your master point is main, and these are all surrounding points, okay? And if you have to treat, eyes, these are simple, simple technique. Actually fixing up seeds, uh, this is not difficult actually. Only thing is you should know correct point. See, now to save time, I'm not focusing this white dot, but you know that whenever you are fixing seed, this white dot should touch the main point, okay? If you have headache, front headache, you are putting seed here, left and right headache, this is right, yes? This is right headache, left headache, nose, yes? If tonsils problem, tonsils for tonsil, black pepper is very good. This black pepper is very good. See? Tonsils. Cuff. Cuff. For cuff, again, black pepper is very good. After doing good massage, yes? Bunch of black pepper. 
this is very very effective very effective when you feel or some kind of irritation in your neck that moment immediately after doing good massage yes you should fix your seed like this like this and then in cold and cough garlic is excellent treatment this is garlic there are many sizes of garlic it is good if you for lung if you take big size garlic so you can cut don't peel the skin with the skin open it takes lung shape also yes and then very quickly i can introduce finger system after this because here uh, it is very easy to apply and it can stay for long time so for this place you can use this garlic uh, big size garlic but this is small size so you can use in finger system see garlic okay like juicy part will touch the skin if you are using on main system you are using big this is small this is small so you will use big piece garlic after doing good moksha and uh, be before you do this garlic application do good massage do moksha and then fix garlic okay but this is small garlic so i prefer using on finger system according to finger system this is lung area and tail of this garlic should look downward yes so this is application on finger system and this you are not pressing yes uh, this is just uh, properties you are using the property the medicinal quality of uh, seed so you are not using acupressure with the garlic okay for acupressure you should press point with the help of probe and then you can fix garlic and then where is ovary point yesterday i didn't tell you ovary point ovaries you see the line here okay come here and you will find this is bone level yes this bone level you can feel here bone level this level you have to maintain this line yes so so this is bone level for example this area is bone level you have to come here this follow this line and when you meet this bone level line here you are making this ovary point ovary point so ovaries are not very close to central line this is big hand yes but here in this hand i can show you see this is my bone this is my bone so follow this line this is ovary and here also very good results are coming if you find the point correctly and then here is uterus so this line yes do good massage ovary cyst excellent results are coming do good massage do moksha and then you can fix star magnet these are magnets actually tomorrow i will tell you about magnets also 
So pointed part should touch the point. Pointed part. There are a variety of magnets actually, but in routine general, uh, we are using the star magnets on the point of ovary. When you are doing for your patient, then you are doing very neat work because I'm doing handling with one hand, so not so neat, but make sure that when you're doing on your patient hand, you should do very neat and clean work, okay? You should look, uh, it should look professional, not untidy. Like this, and then bladder. Now, once you know the point, then you just need to fix the seed after stimulation. Main criteria is, uh to find the main point okay these are just simple examples you can start your treatment and now because tomorrow i want to focus only diseases and because this is very short time but then i'm always thinking that i i have to pick up some important topics so that you can start using uh, the system though this sujok this Correspondent system is big subject, vast subject. At least we need minimum 24 hours, minimum, minimum. Anyway, so I want to introduce fixed insect system, general introduction of insect system. How many, there is a question, how many systems? 22 correspondent systems are there, 22. Some people, they just know main system, insect system, mini system, partial system, but then there are, are more systems, more system, 22 correspondent system. Why do you call insect system? Okay. Just give me one second and I will find out slide. Just a moment. System. Again, insect system is big subject, but uh, I will again focus bold point, just general idea, and will give you important tips. You see, uh, then we I'm introducing now and then tomorrow we can start with this. And then tomorrow I'm just focusing diseases, all diseases after completing this insect system, I will introduce all these, all variety of diseases. You see, when you see the universe, how do you see the universe? Yes, you see upper level, middle level and lower level, sky. Upper level, earth is lower level, and you are in the middle, yes, middle level. So we have three levels, okay? Now very beautifully, you will see in your body also, your body also has three levels, head, chest, and abdomen. Though you don't see clear division line, but head, chest, and abdomen, okay? Now arms are part of the chest, Yes, arms are like loop coming out from the chest. In embryo, there was very strong energy circulation in this area. As a result, arm came out from the chest. And then leg, yes, legs are coming out from the abdomen. So we have three parts, head, chest, abdomen. Again, this is great symbol, yes, because we are part of this universe and human being is the best form which is expressing his laws, his shape of body and his all, uh, you know, outer shape and inner organization is very close to the designs of his mind. Yes, very close to uh, this universe pattern. Yes, it's, even if you see hand, also in future studies, you will come to know that hand is not only body, 
but hand is also expressing fundamental forces of this universe. Four forces, as Professor Park Jevo said, I have not touched that, but in coming time I will touch. So this body is very beautiful reflection and also it is expressing uh, universe. So head, chest, abdomen. Now, when we see these three parts in our body, then this is like tri trinity, three forces, three parts. And Professor Park Jevo found that in your hand, yes, especially in arms and hand, you also, you can see three parts, you see, in arms, in arms, you see three part, this part, this is chest, head, chest, abdomen. I'm not talking about hand and foot. I am talking about arm and leg, yes? Chest, a head, chest, and abdomen. So three part, upper level, middle level, lower level, like universe, upper, middle, lower, body also, upper, then middle level and lower level. So wherever you see three, because of similarity, all these three are corresponding, are communicating with each other. So in finger also, you see three, yes? Upper level, middle level, lower level, very simple. Now, when we are studying finger system, our hand direction is like this, fingertips facing the sky. Finger system is independent system, also has information of complete body. This hand has many, many points, but it is so beautifully organized, there is no traffic. Overlapping concept is there. When you say that we are composed of soul, mind, body, and life, it means we have 99% metaphysical world, metaphysical world. So that is why finger system, this hand system is uh, has many overlapping. So don't confuse with this. So top level is connected with the head, middle level is connected with the chest, and lower level is connected with the abdomen. Very simple. Yes, very simple. I will send picture. Don't worry. I will send picture. Okay. And I will introduce tomorrow also because we have less time. I want to give major glimpse that if person has any head problem, then this area you have to focus. This is upper level. As if three floor, upper level, middle level, lower level. This is also upper, middle, and lower. If person has any chest problem, then you are focusing middle level. Yes, middle level. If person has any disease in the abdomen area, you are focusing lower level. Yes, simple. So this finger system is uh, not tilted like this. In basic system, thumb is tilted, but in finger system, this is there is no tilting. This is very easy system. And contraction part is expressing your this front side, inside, and this back side is uh, your this back body and back body. Okay, so this is major framework. I will teach you tomorrow and then I will start the diseases. But also here for beginners, many times those who don't know Sujo, I'm giving you simple tip. If person has any head problem, when you are doing, because this ring massage, when you talk about ring, this Sujo, this ring is, Oh, one of the most important tool, like seed, yes, you should have cello tape, sorry, you should have that micropore tape, this kind of paper tape, you should have seed and ring, and fourth is probe. Just with these four tools, you can start, you can jump, you can start with your treatment. So this ring, upper floor, any problem in this upper floor, you can tell your patient or you can tell your friend, neighbor, just do all fingertips massage simple all fingertips massage just do this if person has any chest problem then all fingers because each finger is representing complete body so if person has any chest problem then you do ring massage on all middle phalange just with ring massage sometimes you will see great change if person has abdomen gas acidity lower abdomen pain pelvic girdle pain yes any discomfort in the 
abdomen area, then lower floor. Yes, just lower floor. So this is all lower floor. This is all lower floor. Okay. So here you can do this. Whether it is uterus problem, fibroids problem, ovary cyst problem. In this finger system, you have to think that uh, which floor? Very simple. Which floor? Upper, middle, lower. Keeping this uh, finger in this direction. And now, last picture I want to show that why we say insect system. You see, in this finger, we don't see arm. In basic, this is basic system. What we touched yesterday and then uh, in this today's class, uh, front and back. Yes, initial part, this is basic system. And this insect system uh, is finger therapy, representing full body and Professor Park Jeevu gave name insect system. Now, this in this finger, you don't see arm and leg like in basic system, you see complete uh, projection, five projections very clearly, but here you don't see. It means arms and legs are attached like baby, small baby, yes? When baby, you see, newly born baby, his arms and legs are folded and his arms are attached with the chest and legs folded is attached with the, it is compressed, it is contracted. And baby uh, is, in that time, baby is, uh, looks like insect. You can quickly see this. Okay. I really love this picture. You see baby, contracted arm, contracted leg. And as a result, you see this looks, uh, this posture is like insect posture. And then when baby is hungry and baby is crying and then like a grasshopper, he he's opening his arm and leg and then again, he's back to his this posture. So as I told you that uh, hand has information of all your postures, not only this. So baby posture information is also there. So arm and leg projections are here on the sides, okay? Face, chest, abdomen, right arm and legs and left arm and legs all front and this is back straight line this is representing your spine so i will focus tomorrow and now do you have uh, any question if you have any question last few minutes we can talk any question regarding today's topic What is odd? Odd and even, yes. So you just keep in your mind that because female, even number homo, in triogen, this female is homo and male is hetero. So we are using this odd number for, but don't, as a beginner, don't confuse with this. Just do simple moxa and seed therapy. Okay, uh, smile evening. I think some participant has raised uh, his or her hand. You have been unmuted. You can ask your question. Uh, you... Kindly ask your question. Okay. Chandra Lalwani ji, please ask a question. Which seed on energy point? You can use uh, green peas, black pepper. Smile evening, ma'am. Smile evening. It's got wonderful shelter from you. Again and again, we are. And thank you so much. Ma'am, you have suggested for. I cannot hear. Hello, yeah, again, yes. 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 It means you have to give power to kidneys. You can do moksha. And when you cannot do moksha, if person has fever, hyperthyroid or hyperactivity, body is warm, yes, inflammation is there, then don't do moksha. If organ is shrinking, organ is degenerating, then you can do moksha. Okay. Yeah, Abdul Rahman ji, please ask a question. 
uh, along with cold therapy with will moksha apply ma'am or only moksha no kids? don't do cold therapy that was uh, on gallbladder stone only for the stone na yes yes don't only, do that. only the only gb stone or kidney stone ma'am kidney has pathway yes stone should move this is our idea okay, okay. so for the gallbladder stone you do this okay do moksha for 39 huh? um for 7 days madam or long you can continue for chronic cases always i tell tell at least two weeks do moksha continuously and then you can reduce and also for maintenance of your body also once in a week everyone should do seed uh, moksha massage moksha and seed on energy point and for your uh, you know for maintaining your energy level Yes. it is very good to do even if you don't have disease you should do once in a week for yourself uh, um, for problem we are doing continuously in the only week. one question kindly give opportunity to others please abdul rahman ji kindly go ahead thank you sir thank you madam thank you very much madam if some patients have a, a pain in all the points in the whole hand itself when we are searching for the painful points what we can do for that it means that you are pressing uh with probe uh, it means your pressure is very deep on all points if it is correctly you are pressing correctly then you will find master point otherwise if patient is saying that my all points are paining it is very sure that this is deep pressure and and it depends from patient to patient some people are very sensitive to pain some people even if you press very deep they don't feel pain so you have to keep this uh, threshold uh, of patient in your mind hi ma'am this is rushikesh Yes, ma'am. Ha. Uh, ma'am. Uh, there are many patients which are right now with me. Uh, for a uh, urinary infection, urine infection, mm. in lady. So, what the treatment should be done? You know, UTI. This is urinary. Okay. Here, don't do moksha. Do ice massage on the points of bladder. And now you know this finger system, upper floor, lower floor. Very simple. I have not discussed in detail. but now you know where is the can you give me idea where is bladder point lower floor lower lower, lower area lower. so in this area all lower points do ice massage and don't use uh, ice directly use that you have to uh, you know use like a cold pad yes so don't wet your hand so put okay, yes, uh, this in plastic bag and then you can do ice ice massage and then put Uh, this green gram seed and yes, in, and yes and i want to tell you one thing in acute inflammatory diseases don't do vigorous massage you okay. are again okay. activating that uh, energy there we want to sedate so just do general massage and you can do a uh, cold pack after that fix seat Okay, yes. ma'am. Uh, should we done? Uh, means ring massage should be done there in the lower. Don't part. do. A, and whenever you are doing ring massage, this is also very important. Don't press very hard. You have to create some friction. But don't. Uh, some people they are thinking that if we do, uh, you know, we give give deep pressure, then very good result. Fast? No, it is not the criteria. Always you should do. moderate massage you have to create friction that's it and continue okay. this massage until the skin becomes pink okay okay so ma'am like yes yeah, so ma ji kindly uh, one question only can kindly give opportunity okay. to yes, others there are many on the line please ma'am yeah. priyatham ma hello yes ma'am yes ma'am ma'am this is jainti from chennai and i um, mean uh, i have a patient I, my family member who has a tb it's a hyperactive tb tuberculosis and doctor has told that we have also checked up the lungs but there is it is not in lungs and it is in stomach and so the intestines have been in, there is an inflammation of the intestines and uh, a, a, a little liver and a gallbladder it is a slight enlargement so mm. you have you have uh, given us the advice to give us the energy points so we find it's a chronic disease and she has not been tested for a long time 
So in this energy points, you has advised the moksha to be given. So each and every point should I give the moksha at one time or uh, after after uh, keeping a pressure uh, moksha in one, and after it when it burns and I have to keep it in the second one or how it is? You have to give one. After one, then after it after it burns out, then I have to keep it in the second one. Second point. I didn't point. understand. You have to just simply do massage. Okay. And then fix. Uh, you can also do massage. Yin side do clockwise massage. Yang side do anti-clockwise massage. Okay. And in inflammatory disease, don't do moksha. In infection, don't do moksha. Just, okay, just because if but person is feeling weak, you can massage and fix it. And for your case, this is digestive system issue. Yes. Yes. You said stomach and intestine. Stomach TB. Stomach TB. He told. Stomach, stomach TB. TB. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I want to recommend two joints as per tri origin, little finger. And of course, you will do this main system also, stomach point. But in 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 this uh, finger, little finger, middle joint, this joint has connection with uh, stomach and uh, right hand. This middle finger, upper joint, this joint. Yes, you just do seat therapy here on this joint. Along middle, right with your hand, standard. middle finger, which which joint, ma'am? Upper joint. Okay, ma'am. This joint. And okay, uh, little, right. finger, little finger is also right hand, ma'am. Yes, you can do on right hand, and every day do this uh, um, seed therapy. Uh, which seed should I have? Uh, should I give it? Give it for her, ma'am. Green. Uh, yes, you can put four direction seed. One, two, three, four. Green. Um, green green lentils. Okay. Green lentils. Okay, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, next, kindly yes. go ahead. I can see Priya Priya Aji, um, Namaste ji. Uh, my evening, ma'am. It was a wonderful session. Uh, there are two questions related to the session only. The first thing is, uh, you know, you mentioned uh, moksha treatment along with the uh, ice pack. So, he, is it supposed to be given immediately, or there should be immediately? Some... You have to create some kind of vibration immediately. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. And second question is you know, related to seed therapy, ma'am. Um, uh, there is said to be, you know, uh, some seeds are uh, generate heat, some seeds are useful for you know, generating cold. So if you could cover that and also the uh, color of the seed, which color is useful for which treatment, that would be also useful, ma'am. Yes, I just gave you general idea. Seeds which are bright and red color, orange color, green color, Shining seed, bright seed, you can use for chronic cases, very chronic cases. And dull seed, brown seed, black seed. Yes, like buckwheat seed is brown, black, and you can use for acute inflammatory diseases. Okay, Akashi, thank you so much. Akashi, go ahead. Yes, ma'am, uh, one question for me. Uh, my daughter ka fibromyalgia hai both hands ke center mein pain hoga pairon ke center mein bahut pain rehta hai uska bahut zyada uske liye treatment you just start start with energy points as a beginner you just start with energy point treatment this is the okay. best way okay and burning feet ke liye ma'am please actually okay. many reasons Blood yes. pressure, you have to check blood pressure. How is the blood pressure? Uh, no, blood pressure is normal, but only thyroid problem. problem. Ah, thyroid problem, yes. You that know where is, is thyroid point? Yesterday I told yes. you where is thyroid point. Yes, at the thumb point. Yes, start doing. Mm -hmm. And also uh, lifestyle also. Okay, okay. All mm -hmm. these treatment, whatever we are studying in Sujo, we are working on effect. Again, I want to tell you this thing. You have to find out cause. What is her lifestyle? Yes, yes. Food pattern, exercise pattern. Thyroid should do exercise, should maintain this okay. lifestyle also. And where is your ma'am clean? Okay. If Akash, I want to meet. Madam, only kindly give opportunity to others, please. Don't mind. Let others also get the opportunity. Akash, go ahead. Okay, Akash is not coming up. Next goes to Sarita Agrawal ji. Please ask a question. Ma'am, Namaste. Session was very good. Ma'am, can Phimosis be fine from this? Once again, Phimosis can be fine from Phimosis. Yes. First of all, you can also do 
एनर्जी पॉइंट करना शुरू कर दीजिए ओके okay. और मैम और ये जो पिसारे गर्म हो जाते हैं मैंने हमारे कोई भी ऑर्गन तो उसमें क्या सभी में हम आइस पैक दे सकते हैं जैसे पेट गर्म हो गया बोलते हैं लीवर में गर्मी है या गोल ब्लेडर में गर्म आप तो, कैसे कह सकते हैं गर्मी है जब फील होता है ना कभी छाले हो गए कुछ हो गया पेट गर्म लगता है ऐसे दिमाग ये होता है तो फिर मैम क्या उसमें आइस पैक दे सकते हैं आप दे सकते हैं बट रीजन मालूम होना चाहिए ओके इस रीजन मालूम होना चाहिए बट आप दे दीजिए ओके थैंक यू मैम नेक्स्ट पार्टिसिपेंट विद द नेम भूपेंद्र कौर प्लीज गो अहेड ओके नॉट कमिंग अप वी गो टू द नेक्स्ट पारुल जी प्लीज गो अहेड पारुल जी आस्क योर क्वेश्चन ओके Arul ji, you kindly ask ah, your ma- question. Yeah, yeah, ma. Actually, I was not uh, on uh, unmute, ma'am. Ma'am, I have one personal question, uh, but I want just yes or no from you. I've got multiple uh, diseases coming up just within two months. I have IBS related watery loose motions, skin rashes, arthritis, very high BP of one eighty, one ten, heart problem. एंड एवरी डे कुछ ना कुछ होता है तो ये सब सुजोग में मैम प्रेशर पॉइंट कलर पॉइंट इसमें आ जाएगा तो जोक इज नॉट जस्ट प्रेशर पॉइंट यू सी दिस इज स्टार्टिंग मोमेंट यू आर लर्निंग सो जोक इज वेरी हाई हाँ नाउ आई डोंट नो बट आई कैन फील योर इमोशनल सिचुएशन आपके लास्ट टू मंथ्स में क्या था कुछ इमोशनल सिचुएशन था कुछ नहीं था मैम सडनली एक दिन आईज में ब्लड क्लॉटिंग हुआ तो सर को बताने गए तो 180 बाय 110 था उसके बाद फिजिशियन को बताया तो वो बोले कि हार्ट में प्रॉब्लम है कि हार्ट पंप नहीं कर रहा है एरिया में तो उसकी वजह से भी बीपी रहता है एंड अभी पता नहीं मुझे आधे से ज्यादा दवाई की एलर्जी भी है तो स्किन रैशेज वॉटर लूज मोशन और भी आथराइटिस सब एक साथ जमा हो रहा है और ऐसे नहीं है कि कुछ निकल रहा है सब आते ही जा रहा है नया नया आप स्माइल कर रहे हैं हाँ मैम रोज मैं बोलती हूँ कि मैं ठीक हूँ मैं ठीक हूँ मैं ठीक हूँ ओके ओके व्हाट यू डू नाउ जस्ट स्टार्ट योर ट्रीटमेंट विथ फोर पॉइंट एवरी डे ओके वेरी सिंपल आई एम गिविंग यू आप लिख लीजिए जी मैम बताइए ब्रेन हार्ट हाँ हार्ट ब्रेन हार्ट किडनी एंड दूसरे हाथ में एनर्जी पॉइंट करिए आप ओके मैम कंबाइन दिस and if you have understood foot agar aapko foot samajh mein aata hai you can do on foot also but anyway now you are beginner just do this simple start start something okay ma'am to isme pressure pressure ya seed ya aise kuch kaam aata hai massage of course yes massage because see you are beginner in sujo and ah. actually when we study six key we understand your constitution now i can understand also while you are speaking but at the same time now uh, in because you have just little basic correspondence system understanding you do this brain heart kidney and energy points start with this okay ma'am okay thank you very much ma'am okay pankaj ji go ahead pankaj ji yes 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 sir yeah good evening go ahead या गुड इवनिंग मैडम थैंक यू सर गुड इवनिंग मैडम दिस इज पंकज अग्रवाल मैडम मेरा वाइफ का ना हार्ट का वॉल को माय वाइफ हैंग हार्ट वॉल प्रॉब्लम तो डॉक्टर ने एरियोटिक वाले मैटरल वॉल दिस बोथ द वॉल गेट स्मॉल साइज सो डॉक्टर सजेस्टेड टू रिप्लेस द नीड टू बी डू ओपन हार्ट ऑपरेशन सो आई वांट टू नो मैडम एनी सुजोग थेरेपी दैट कैन रिपेयर माय हार्ट माय वाइफ हार्ट प्रॉब्लम्स हार्ट वॉल बोथ द मैटरल वॉल एंड एरियोटिक वॉल so how can reverse that uh, disease is madam so they told that there some deposit has happened on the walls okay so jo can do wonders only thing is now we are studying just simple topic but then uh, 
triurgian part in sujo can touch wonders because i am talking again and again of metaphysical world physical world is destroyed yes you cannot recover but you can increase the metaphysical capacity of that organ but now i cannot explain yes because we have to understand this deeply but please start doing heart point and you know the correct position of heart you know correct location of heart yes yesterday yes, yes, i focused yes. correctly please start doing on both hand and keep seeds yes keep changing and one hand 24 hours keep seeds on that area and then next day here like this keep changing and just do, start doing okay sir so which seed matter green uh, green gram seed right you can use green gram you can use okay. star magnet also okay great great ma'am thank you very much ma'am thank okay. you okay next next uh, yes. participant with uh -huh. the name open the yeah go ahead Hadija. Sir, good evening, ma'am. I'm really blessed, you know, after attending, feeling blessed after attending your session. Ma'am, I had one small query. Ki jaise na, like nowadays, we are doing a lot of screen work. So for the eyes, which seeds we should apply? Literally, my eyeballs are paining because of screen. Time has increased. Black pepper. Black pepper on both the thumbs. Yes. And ma'am, even for the tennis elbow, can you tell me, ma'am, tennis elbow? Where is elbow joint? Tell me. Ma'am, it's it's actually here. Actually, my sister is having a lot of pain for that. Elbow joint. You see which elbow, left or right? Ma'am, I think it's right. Yes. Anyway, right or left? Okay. Side two fingers are arms. You know this? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Center joint is this is right elbow and this side is left elbow. If it is right elbow, do it on right hand. If it is left elbow, choose left hand. So anyway, middle joint of these side two fingers, you have to do this massage and do seat therapy. So you see, I am telling as per the level of your understanding. We have many things. We can do many things. But simple treatment is sometimes giving miraculous treat, uh, result if you do it correctly. Ma'am, which seeds to apply for the tennis elbow? You can use this uh, fenugreek. Okay, Thank you. Okay. Next, Manisha ji, kindly go ahead. Yes. Hello. Hello. Okay. Hello. <coughs> Haan, yes. Hello, yes, madam. Uh, uh, madam, where in a pair pay, I have a lot of swelling on my foot. I have slip disc, diabetes also. So, foot ke liye, wai se jo apne leg ke point hai, jo aage ka foot, wai karna hai. The swelling ke liye bhi. Now, what is your main? Now, what is your C? You have many problem, but then in this present moment, as a beginner, you can uh, understand. Uh, I want to give you simple points so that you can focus. I think swelling is your main criteria. Yeah, it's for many years. Hmm? Yeah. Yes. So you and just do your kidney. Point. You do your kidney point, <clears throat> liver, and huh? this ring massage, foot swelling. Yes. Middle two fingers are legs and this area you should do. All do ring massage on these middle two fingers more often. Yes, at least do three to four times and uh, roll this ring, uh, ring. And along with this, I told you, do liver point, kidney yeah. points along with this and one brain point. And one brain. Brain. Brain point. And... Yes. Uh, uh, um, and madam, can you put this on WhatsApp? Uh, some WhatsApp group can it be created? Madam, already for, uh, already group is there. Okay, WhatsApp already there is a Telegram group. Kindly join the Telegram group. We got a YouTube channel also going. All the problems have been listed there. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. And for I also uh, have you. swelling ribs. Uh, ribs pe bhi swelling hai. So. Uske liye lungs ka point hi karne ka. Middle floor, middle floor. You remember that? Yes, yeah. yeah. On se floor mein problem hai aapke? Lungs mein, so mid, middle aya. Middle floor. See, I gave you very simple yeah, technique. Yes, yeah. Upper yeah. floor problem, middle floor and lower floor. Okay. So all the fingers, middle floor. Yes. Okay, okay. thank yeah. you. Thank La Lakshmi ji, kindly go ahead. Lakshmi ji. Uh, uh, thank you. I missed uh, a lot today. 
uh, will be like get why is this not your voice is breaking i, I think you uh, you don't have correct uh, headset or mic set which you are using can you am i audible now yes please slightly better okay thank uh, you for the session and uh, i am quite a lot to read is there on one one and a half hours will i one will i get to see that and follow it in the the telegram or the somehow that one thing and secondly i would also want to i want to ask uh, that uh, what do we do for uh, uh, any allergy which we have not to react on the body which uh, leads to water retention in the body i heard last part your voice is not clear but i i could hear allergy something you are talking about allergy so you have to focus liver points very nicely for all allergies for okay all allergies focus liver point okay and uh, and will that uh, clear uh, water retention and also for water retention liver and kidney these two points are very good kidney points and liver okay and will we get the milk out session of today i'm <laughs> uh, sorry we will not be able to give you because we have certain policy of the academy we have to follow those next thank you next uh, participant kindly shoot your question no ma'am uh very nice session uh, i want to ask about the uh, back pain uh, regarding the vertebra l2 and l3 has slightly shifted and uh, the uh, disease what the doctor are saying is re retrolithesis and uh, can it be reverted back because they are saying that it cannot be reverted back and from the one year i am been suffering from this you don't think see creators miracles can always happen if you say can it be then it means you have given up okay just do it and you see so joke is not giving any side effect yes so, ma'am just do it just these innocent seeds yes if you understand the power of this seed you see how much is the quality of your understanding seed therapy just one seed has great power the yeah. seed has soul mind body life so which floor lower floor upper floor or middle floor okay let's talk like this yeah yeah lower 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 floor see so good very easy now in lower floor front or back 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 so we go back. like this back left side okay. very simple you go back and then in back left line run uh, right line or center line this is on the left side your spine problem where is there where is spine spine is in, in the middle yeah middle so you are focusing middle line yes yeah in this middle line then you can arrange seats in the form of chain like this and all lower phalange of each finger you should massage more often Okay, okay, and then, then this seed. If you believe this, if you understand this, seed has great miraculous power. Seed has soul. Seed has soul. Okay, so every day do this, and in main system also you have spine point. I told you how to do it. Which seed Just I have? Work. Which seed I have to apply here? In here, you can fix a uh, fenugreek one day fenugreek and one day green lentil. Okay. Uh, and in, the, in this in this back backbone region spine region that uh, you can fix this uh, piece uh, green dry piece green dry piece or okay. black pepper black pepper also theek hai thank you ma'am okay uh, uma uh, yeah. krishna murti ji you can speak I, firstly pranam to you you are the most yeah, senior yes, most person you, sir, here thank you <laughs> thank you thank you smile evening madam your session as thank beautiful as your smile Smiley, yeah, madam. Uh, I have one doubt, madam, because last time also we missed that. Uh, so, one, two of my patients actually they lose their semen while you uh, they do urination. 
So last time you told that we can discuss later on, okay? But again, uh, we could not able Start to reach you. Start doing and bladder points in this moment. Okay. Uh, which seats, madam? Uh, the same seats, like uh, yes. kidney for beans kidney and that. For kidney, kidney beans and on bladder, okay. you can use this. Also, if you can manage star magnet, you can use star magnet also. And okay. uh, you can use this green gram or black pepper. Okay. Okay. Egal bladder and uh, kidney, kidney, right, ma'am? You said bladder. Oh, sorry. Ma'am, voice is uh, like uh, getting disturbed. I, I don't know. Some interruption is there. So half word, half sentence I heard like this. Yeah, madam. Uh, and okay, two energy point treatment. Okay, madam. Fine. Is it like uh, at least they do get results before at least 115 days, ma'am? Pardon? Uh, when they'll start getting the results, ma'am, at least 15 days, at least if they'll come to know small results, then we can continue yes, for yes, three to six months. Yes, yes, please do it in 15 days. You will get some glimpse. Okay, madam. Fine. Okay. Thank you so much. Fine. 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 Sorry, Anita ji, you you are not audible and we cannot understand you. Shaitika, I will touch tomorrow. There is some, I will teach tomorrow. Asha Shinde ji, you can speak, uh, ask your question. One second. Hello. Yes. yes we, we can hear you. Yeah, ma'am. I just wanted to know about the hepatitis B with HDPT is 300. Uh, with liver point and energy point, whether it yes. will be Yes, you please start doing it. Liver point on main system and uh, in finger system, which floor? Upper, middle, lower? Lower. Lower. Okay, this is lower floor. And where is... Yeah. So this lower is means your abdomen. And liver yeah. is located in the upper of... Now, in this floor, upper, middle, or lower? Liver. Uh, up, uh, it is on the lower side. Where is liver in this lower floor? This is lower, agreed. Okay, you have reached Towards it. the right hand side. Don't focus left and right. Now just okay. focus this lower square. And where is liver? Yeah. Up or low? Low. Liver is lower. Uh, uh, one second. Uh, liver is upper center. level. Yeah. Upper level one third. Yeah, upper level one third. Yeah, correct. Okay. Liver is in, mm. this is abdomen area and liver is in the upper one third level. Stomach, okay, okay. spleen, pancreas, liver, all are located in the upper level. Yes. Okay. So you have to massage this area, mm. this area, all fingers. That is why I'm, I'm guiding you just focus this upper level, one, this area. For all, all fingers, fingers. This area. Try to find painful point. Okay. Okay. Hey, Thank Prakash you. And the energy point should I give? Oh. Oh yes. Yeah. Energy point is very good. Uh, okay. Thank you very much. Uh, hello. Uh, smile evening, ma'am. Uh, so yesterday you said that uh, say nose uh, for nose bleeding you have to put a rubber band uh, uh, at the tip of the nose uh, in the upper uh, phalange. Um, for gum bleeding. Okay, so I will send video in the group for this kind of emergency treatment, bleeding, and I have this video. I will send in the group. Okay, yeah, thank you, Vena. Okay. Sadia ji, you are the old student. Go ahead. Uh, hello, good evening, uh, good evening ma'am. Good evening. Uh, I have to, I have problem regarding nose, ma'am, adenoids. Audience, just doing by nose correspondent, it will be cured, ma'am. Do nose point and also this stimulate, stimulate on the yin yang area also. Nose 
and uh, stimulation near the air point also air yes on and on all fingers now you know upper floor nose belongs to upper floor yeah yes ma'am find the center point nose and when you treating left right and center like this you have to put okay ma'am uh, we can apply uh, black pepper black pepper also and green gram also okay ma'am prakash sharma ji go ahead prakash sharma ji हेलो नमस्ते मैडम नमस्ते मैडम मेरी वाइफ को जैसे गोल ब्लडर में स्टोन है और वीकनेस काफी रहती है पेट भी बहुत खराब लगता है और उल्टिया बहुत लगती है उनको एनर्जी पॉइंट इमीडिएटली स्टार्ट कर दीजिए आप एंड गोल ब्लडर स्टोन का मैंने बताया आपको आज है ना एनर्जी पॉइंट तो आप स्टार्ट कर दीजिए इमीडिएटली एक बार गोल ब्लडर का पॉइंट का एरिया बता देंगे एरिया आपको बताया था कल अटेंड किया था क्लास निकल नहीं कर पाया था मैं ओके गोल ब्लैडर इज अपर फ्लोर ओके जस्ट अ मोमेंट आई हैव टू मे बी जस्ट कैन यू सी हाउ ओके ओके this is your right hand or you see this in this hand this is liver this okay. area and here you have to search anyway i have to send picture i will send picture now because we should okay. gallbladder is the area which you have to find correct point not randomly you can do it so i will send picture and you see that picture and then on that point start doing treatment and in a uh, finger system this is lower floor gallbladder is here in lower floor and upper region yeah. here just yeah. try to find okay, this is a small area try to find the point here to yahan pe methi seeds laga do methi nahi to black pepper ya um, green gram Okay. Okay. Uh, next, next participant. I think uh, Shweta ji kindly ask your question. Yes. Shweta thank ji. you. Uh, thank you. Good evening, ma'am. So uh, I like to know that uh, I have discomfort in the chest, breast, and the underarm. So uh, sometime underarms I have pain. So I have already started the ring uh, from past one week, I think. So uh, I mean now pain is not there, but still discomfort is there in uh, underarms, so, breast, and chest. Yes. Breast yes. is your this finger system is middle floor problem. Okay. Yeah. Massage this and just apply seeds. Ah, uh, where can I apply seeds in in the middle side? Middle floor, because this whole area is okay. involved. Yes, middle floor, and you can fix seed green lentil here in this middle floor, and then one day here like this. Keep changing your fingers. Only thing is that you should find the painful point with the help of probe. Then it is very good. Your treatment will become very good. Okay, so one finger at one time, right? I mean, one day, one finger. It is not necessary. Yes. Okay. It is not necessary. You can take two here also, two here also. Actually, uh, when surgical therapists are doing treatment, they are trying to find painful point. In whichever finger we are finding painful point, we are choosing that finger for treatment. But in your case, you are beginner okay. and you don't know. Uh, that is why I am recommending that. Focus uh, on all fingers one by one, two fingers or one finger like this. Okay, so can I put in the night? Uh, I mean, for eight hours or six hours? Yes, yes. Seeds, no side effect. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Uh, next participant with the name N G Samson. Yeah. Hi. Uh, good evening, ma'am. Uh, good evening. Uh, Ma'am, uh, you uh, spoke about uh, ovaries is today uh, about putting star magnet. So we have different kinds of ovary cyst. So, koi bhi tarah ka cyst ho dissolve ho jayega usse? Yes, yes. Please continue. Again, in main system, you know ovary points, and in finger system, lower uh, floor, lower area, lower near area. the last near last joint. Okay. So if we put star magnet on all these four points. 
international riding school not necessary star magnet you can put this green gram also and if you can manage if you can find paint for point it is very good endometriotic cyst pe moksha karna chahiye kya chocolate cyst jo hota hai aap simple seed therapy karna shuru kar dijiye acha because wo inflammation ki wajah se hota hai to moksha that is why i said you simply do seed therapy thank you thank you Uh, next ranjita ji kindly ask a question yeah ranjita ji ranjita kapoor okay next uh i think ranjita ji is calm just a minute yeah ranjita ji and it's fine ask uh... all for you. Ma'am said that she will explain about sciatica tomorrow. Thank you so much. God bless. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Neelu Malik ji. Yeah. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening. Ma'am, just wanted to ask, like, my daughter, elder daughter. She is around twenty-three years old. She has a sebaceous cyst, and predominantly on the head side. So once she was operated, but again she has got uh, multiple sebaceous cysts. And on the uh, underarm as well. Mm -hmm. oh. Not underarm. Mm. It is on the uh, elbow and shoulder. के बीच में. Elbow and shoulder के बीच में. As well as on the on the head. Okay, 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 okay. So you can forcist. Okay. Sebaceous. Generally, for, yes, forcist. We have to focus liver and also in that correspondent area now. Generally, we are sedating humidity as per six key. We are sedating humidity energy, but anyway, you can start start doing treatment on uh, on liver points and on the correspondent area. Okay. Wherever you are finding cyst, find the point, find that area, upper floor, middle floor, lower floor, like this. It is mainly on the hair area. Then which floor? At uh, top floor. Yes. Uh, head floor. Yes, please start doing that, and along with this, do liver points. But it uh, the hair will come on the nail point. Yes, you do all tip point, all okay. tip points. Yes. Okay. 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 Thank you very much, ma'am. Thank you. Okay, next participant, uh, Sutan Sutan Tirajan, please. Uh, yes. Hello, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Good evening. Good evening. Very good evening, ma'am. Thanks for your wonderful session, ma'am. Ma'am, um, uh, I have one question regarding uh, my husband is having a burning sensation at the back side, ma'am. In left burning, side, burning, burning sensation. sensation for some times only, not continuously. Uh, for some times. Any only. medical history behind this? No, ma'am. No medical history. Uh, in front chest area also, sometimes he had that prickling pain, but uh, now it has uh, subsided. But uh, he is having a burning sensation behind the, in the back, left side. Back. B B. And since how long, ma'am? Uh, for uh, about uh, six months. Six months. Not and continuous pain. It is coming. Uh, any report, MRI, spine, any any checkups? No, no, ma'am. No, no. We didn't do any checkup. We just uh, following that. Uh, we are. Uh, following auricular treatment okay but anyway you should always go for a checkup and then you can follow auricular or sujo whatever but at least we need to know we we should know the report we should know okay. what is happening okay. yes we, okay what we kind of follow test whatever test you are doing it is good okay. but we should know what is happening inside the body and that medical is so this is a holistic approach we have okay. to take help from medical also to know what is happening inside okay, okay? and okay. then in you have to do on spine treatment just start doing and because you see it looks like burning and i cannot tell without knowing any without knowing the real cause i cannot tell that do ice massage temporary okay. so surface okay. level problem it is very good if it is surface some skin warmness you are feeling then you can okay. do i mas ice massage i pack okay. ice okay. but okay. internally i don't know you just start doing your spine points and okay. please go for a checkup okay ma he is also having a small a little prickling pain in the bladder urine bladder ma yes 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 so spine point bladder point and go for a checkup 
ओके मैम ओके मैम थैंक यू थैंक यू हितेश जी हितेश जी गो हेड नमस्ते मैडम नमस्ते आज मेरे राइट साइड डेक में ना थोड़ा सुन हो गया है एक बात पर दस दिन हो गया है वो सुन कम नहीं हो रहा है थोड़ा भारी पन लग रहा है राइट हैंड राइट लेग राइट लेग राइट लेग में सुन हो गया मतलब खाली पन मतलब लेग में कहाँ पर मतलब लेग तो बहुत बड़ा होता है कमर से घुटन तक खाली So up just start uh, with your ring massage right leg right hand middle finger first is this yes massage of this and i need to know exact area because if i am finding painful point then i need to know exact area right leg right leg charo taraf where right leg me front side knee ke niche ne knee ke upar aur number se knee tak you just do lumbar points yes lumbar points and mm. then uh, in finger system right leg okay right leg this is my right hand and also in your right hand take this index finger and or you take little finger you have to focus this area or little finger corner area right hand little finger corner area try to do massage in this area and if it is good if you can find painful point here in this area actually if you really touch find succeed in finding painful point results are very fast so anyway i am telling you the territory 1 2 3 4 right leg is here on the yin yang line तीन साल पहले मेरे को है ना स्लिप भी हुआ था हम्म देन लंबर लंबर तो कुछ नस दबने से वो खाली पन होते हैं लंबर यू हैव टू टेक केयर आप लंबर का करिए लंबर साथ में करिए और ये वाले पॉइंट शुरू कर दीजिए और रिंग मसाज चालू कर दीजिए लंबर यू नीड गुड ट्रीटमेंट ऑन लंबर पॉइंट्स यू कैन डू मोक्सा आल्सो मोक्सा एंड सीट थेरेपी मैडम शास्ता बेगम काइंडली आस्क अ क्वेश्चन माय गुड इवनिंग मैम माय गुड इवनिंग मैम एक्चुअली वो 9 ईयर ओल्ड गर्ल बेबी ऑफन शी इज गेटिंग अ स्टमक पेन एंड हेडेक आई हैव मसाज्ड ऑल द करस्पोंडेंस पॉइंट्स हाउ कैन यू से दैट शी हैज स्टमक पेन शी इज टेलिंग शी इज टेलिंग शी इज टेलिंग Yeah, see, children. Very... They don't know that this is my exact stomach area. Maybe some cause. Did you go to doctor? Yes, sir. I didn't travel. No, no, ma'am. Please, you should go to doctor. You oh. should know. Is it stomach oh. or spleen or pancreas or liver or gallbladder? Yes, but she's but having today, continuous headache also, ma'am. Yes. Anyway, this is up in, in finger system. You see this white color. all uh, in finger all fingers this area lower area you have to uh, do this ring massage and try to find the points and then headache you know this point yeah. and then one check up is required yeah i have checked in that the correspondence uh, lower point madam she is having the pain yes so ma'am. headache today you do point find point on thumb yes. and do nice treatment on both thumb and ask how is headache With the okay. probe, you have probe. Yeah, ma'am. I okay. have. He's done both the courses, level one and level two. Yeah. Okay, then you know. Then you can work on stomach meridian also. Yeah, stomach meridian. I gave good massage with the probe, ma'am. She is telling all the four, four and four, eight fingers. She is feeling pain. There, some severe pain is there. For a headache, what I did was. Did you try? That, did you try stomach meridian sedation? Uh, that I didn't. Since she is a small girl, no. So I did on the correspondence alone. No, no, no problem. But just try for few minutes stomach meridian sedation, and of course, correspondent you are doing already. Yeah. Shall I put the bar magnet for her? You can put. Meridian. And then, and then this uh, you can ask if you feel discomfort. She can tell you. Okay, ma'am. I'll try that also. And do head points today. Sure, ma'am. I'll do that. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, next participant with the name Bhupinder Kaur, please go ahead. Namaste, ma'am. Namaste. 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 Namaste.
loudly please next participant with the name bhupender kaur okay saroj ji saroj hello ma'am hello any i am 7 years old any treatments for skin disease fungal infection white spots on chest back and face skin okay. darkening in shoulders please guy okay and uh, who is having this disease me hmm me oh, okay Okay. Who will treat you? Your mother, or you will treat yourself? Mother. Who will treat? Mother. Okay. <laughs> okay. But you expressed very well. Okay. So you have skin disease. Hmm. Okay. This is just skin. Okay. Now, I for this I will tell you in left hand. Top joint. Top joint blue color. and then along with this pituitary gland adrenal gland and this your mother is writing or you are writing ma'am just hold on ma'am i'm writing ma'am just to see your child is very cute thank you ma'am again left hand index finger upper joint index finger upper joint hmm upper joint finger upper joint put blue color okay now and then i told you uh kidney points and middle floor green color and also in one finger green color in another finger you can do seeds green gram green lentil seed on the middle phalange then kidney point is like i have to apply what kidney no. kidney beans i have to apply for kidney point right yes okay and color therapy i told you left hand index finger upper joint blue color kidney point and middle phalange green color and in one finger i mean in one hand you have to apply the green gram right and adrenal point you said earlier yes adrenal gland kidney points it will automatically touch okay next participant with the name bhupender kaur go ahead hello ma'am yes ma'am uh, my husband is having a problem called costochondritis and it's a inflammation of joints uh, in chest area so can you please suggest me some treatment for that yes in right moment in this moment do this blue color in this uh, middle phalange okay ma'am in one hand and then in this second hand do seed therapy in this area middle floor middle floor ma'am because keep changing fingers another day this finger color and then uh, don't use permanent marker use white okay, board marker blue color blue color okay white ma'am white board and marker Okay, ma'am. And green gram should I put, ma'am? Green gram or yes. which which seed? Green gram. Okay. And ma'am, one more thing, ma'am. Uh, in my one eye, there is a fluid collection behind the retina. What mm -hmm. can be done, ma'am, for that? Because of that, I am having blurring and one black patch in my eye. Hmm. When I now look at it, yes. Now you know eye points. Yes, ma'am. And also, uh, though I have not told you, but in thumb below the nail if you can manage these two points yes ma'am i can yes so these two points put seeds which seed ma'am every day keep changing the hand every day and uh, you know this eye point also yes, one hand this point and on the other hand you can put this point okay ma'am which color should i put ma'am black black color for uh, fluid collection in retina Okay, behind fluid collection. Fluid yes. collection be behind, okay. behind the retina. Yes, you put green color. Green color, ma'am. Okay, and with seed, ma'am. So green then, lentil. 
green green lantern. lantern. Yes. yes. Okay. Green color, green lantern. Yes. Okay. Yes. Green lantern. Okay. Ma'am, this will help to dry up the fluid. Please do it. Okay, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Please ma do it. Okay, ma'am. I'm Thank not you. thinking. I'm just doing a treatment. Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Thank you so much, ma'am. Okay, Ji. Uh, a very thank you for uh, being here. Thank you, ma'am. And uh, I'm treated by my therapist, and I'm free of medicines from arthritis now. And I'm I'm helping people who are in arthritis. I just need one tip, ma'am. Uh, with arthritis patient, they already have joint pains in their fingers. Uh, so what should I follow as a first uh, protocol? Arthritis patient, you just give this gift to them first. Ring. Okay. Thank just you. give them and teach them how to do it correctly. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Just do it. Though we do many things, but then at least start, they should start with this on all joint. And okay. don't press very hard. Yeah, because uh, using the probe and finding the painful points is difficult because I don't know whether they uh, from the pain because of the painful point or because of arthritis. It is uh, so sweet dog. <laughs> hmm. Actually, my the therapist, uh, I should say, she treated me at the metaphysical level. That's why I felt I, I had a cure. So I'm thankful. <laughs> and you know that metaphysical can heal very nice. Yeah. But um, to bring them to that level, we need to <coughs> the pain is gone. Then only they will keep, keep the trust and keep going on the procedure. That's why. Uh, yes. you, you do just give ring to her. Otherwise, for joints, we are doing treatment on gallbladder, meridian gallbladder points. Okay. okay next, Jyoti Batraji. Jyoti Batraji. Jyoti My Batraji. Sir, ma'am. Thank you so much for the wonderful session. Ma'am, I needed a guidance for a 23-year-old girl. Uh, she is a cerebral palsy patient, okay. uh, literally on bed. So, mm -hmm. this came in my mind that probably we can give her uh, energy points. Mm -hmm. Probably, but she would not allow anyone to touch her, you know, to do anything, any color application or anything else we can do. Yes, brain points. Brain yes, points. Ma G brain, yes, brain points. Start doing brain points now. Okay, or pituitary and that. All, so both, both yes, those all points. fingertips start doing. All fingertips, but don't do in one day. One day this, one day this. At least now she you can do it. She doesn't allow anyone to touch or, you know, do any stimulation. Hmm. So she can we apply allow... any color? Just apply and leave. Probably that will be easy to manage for the mother. She's... Okay. Then you apply green color. Neutral brain color. Point, brain point green color. But I like to do seed. At least do on one, one thumb at least. Okay, ma'am. Do uh, you have any knowledge of level two? Or just yes, this ma one? Yes, ma'am. Did it hmm? with you only. Okay. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Okay, then you can do brain meridian, spiritual point. Okay, ma'am. So we apply chain of seed on that? Brain meridian you can apply and also you can do on Hello. spiritual point. You remember that spiritual point of brain meridian level 2? Okay, any other question? We are, uh, Mr. Pankaj Agrawal. Smile evening, ma'am. Smile evening. Uh, ma'am, uh, I have uh, got one patient. Uh, she's having fibroids in your train. And fibroid size is uh, around 10 centimeter by 9 centimeter by 7 centimeter. Mm. And along with uh, multiple myelomas. Hmm. So kindly advise how to go for it. Uh, response is very slow. And what all you have done, Dr. Pankaj, yes? Yeah. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Uh, what I all have you done, have done? Uh, okay, so far I have uh, given her uh, uh, treatment, particularly related to color because her skin is very sensitive. Mm -hmm. So she doesn't can you respond. Tell me what anything. treatment you have given so that I can understand and we can change or we can add more. Okay, I have given mainly treatment on uh, uh, 
sort of uh, main version and insect version right for uh, by way of chakra magnet and star magnets because skin is very sensitive even needles uh, are not uh, acceptable to her skin because of multiple myeloma thing and uh, blood starts uh, oozing out immediately so need your uh, advice how to bleeding treat this also? Protein. bleeding also yes yes mm -hmm. bleeding also and what what is uh, you can you repeat his uh, medical report what is the exact okay what... uh, her age is uh, 42 mm -hmm. and uh, fibroids mm -hmm. in uh, your trade mm -hmm. size is 10 cm by 8 by 7 cm mm -hmm. along with multiple myelomas mm -hmm. so that's the scenario so a bit okay. complicated case don't worry. Uh, so, you know six key, yes? Yes, yes. Yes, ma'am. Very good. So, in J meridian, mm -hmm. in spinal cord meridian, as I told you that uh, all uterus diseases, you should work on J meridian. Right. Our right, hotness, right. yes? Mm -hmm. On our hotness meridian, you sedate uterus fibroids. Um, right you start sedating dryness. Okay. Okay. Yes. Dryness right. point. Color therapy at least you can do dryness point and heat tonification and you inform governing vessel meridian. Along with this, right. you are doing uh, correspondence point. Main system, finger system, mini system. Right. Yes. Right. And uh, energy point, of course. Right, ma'am. Energy point. But ma'am, Chakra magnet or star magnet, uh, which one should uh, help in this? When you are doing six key treatment, then don't combine all. Combine all. Okay, okay. Don't make mixture. Okay. Be confident with your six key. Be confident right, with your six key. Hmm. Right, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Uh, next, Vikas ji, go ahead. Vikas ji. Uh, Hello. Vikas. Is not Hello, there. Ma uh, yeah, madam, uh, madam uh, I got a C-section five, five months ago. Uh, I have a severe back pain always. It's not a pain. It's like uh, some inflammation. Now the problem is like uh, uh, the whole day I'm sitting, not a problem. Once I lie down uh, in the midnight, it's very difficult to get down. Right side completely, some something, some some. I cannot roll and I cannot uh, sleep. Uh, I, I, I cannot yes. get up also. Someone has to lift me. Some yes. gas is going inside, ma'am. When I'm eating, uh, drinking zero water, uh, then some gas is released. Thing, uh, then I can get up. So what to do, man? Do you have this gastric issue? Um, I don't know, ma'am. I'm not eat. I'm eating mostly raw food and the fresh food, but still, I, I'm I'm trying to close my mouth and don't sleep. eat I'm... exact raw. Don't at least semi cook. Don't eat if you have this kind of issue. Don't eat raw food. Okay, ma'am. Yes. What about coconut? Eating coconut is good? Coconut no? is good. Coconut is mm -hmm. good. But uh, you can cook a little bit and then you can mm -hmm. semi-boil like this. And um, then uh, stomach point. Because and... mama, when, I'm, when I'm eating cooked food and all, my acidity and some inflammation also going up. So I'm trying to eat raw food, cucumber, carrot, cabbage. Cucumber, uh, cucumber like... is good. Cucumber is uh -huh. good. You can eat. Uh, okay. 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 Uh -huh. So uh -huh. you can focus your stomach point, of course. And then right hand, right hand, this joint, upper joint. On this joint, you do seat therapy. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then okay. do treatment of spine. Treatment of spine. Okay. Spine, I have to do in left hand. You can choose any hand. Any no problem. Hand. Okay. Only okay. thing is in these cases, again and again, I'm yes. saying that a painful point is important. Painful point. Okay, okay. Okay, thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you. Next participant, next participant, I can't decipher. Kindly speak with the name of the call. Hello. I'm going to ask you. 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 I'm Okay. Probably they are discussing with among themselves. So we can ask the next guest. 
Which floor? Upper, middle, lower? Uh, upper side. In finger system, which floor? In the middle, middle portion, huh? Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Middle floor. Yes. So start focusing all your treatment in this middle floor. All fingers one by one. Try to check point, painful point. So this middle floor is your target. Okay. Hmm. Start okay. doing it. Yeah. Then may any seed? Uh, green gram, green lentil. Okay. 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 Thank you, ma'am. राजकुमार जी राजकुमार जी नमस्कार Yeah, Renu ji. Oh. Renu ji. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening. I had two operations in 2017, one for stone and one for prostate. Hmm. Then in this year, I got the op operated for hernia, and hmm. and while going from ultrasound, it was noted that. The prostate has again been enlarged. It is fifty-four percent. Mm. Mm. Can you guide, please? Prostate gland. You remember yesterday I told you you have to stimulate this here lower point here. You have to. Actually, have to I am attending this course, this program for the first time today, so oh, I don't know missed, anything. You missed yesterday's class. Yes. Anyway, you start yes. doing this point here. Yes, this point here. Okay. okay. And in finger system, lower floor. Now you understand this. At least today's class, you will understand. Okay. All for, all Start for... focusing massage and seeds every day. Massage and seeds. You have to do it very nicely. Massage and seeds. Okay. Okay, ma'am. All, all four fingers. Actually, see. Actually, when we are doing, we are trying to find painful point. But you are beginners. You don't know this. That is why I am telling you one by one. Attend all fingers. Routine okay. wise, two fingers. Now next day, two fingers. But when I am doing, maybe I need just one finger. Okay. So you have told us uh, two two points. One is stomach area, lower uh, lower joint. For the, what? The third 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 uh, floor. Third floor lower joint. Uh, this prostate only. Uh, okay. Yes. Yes. For yeah. Lower floor, yes. Lower yes. floor, last joint, and yes. an another is uh, this uh, 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 ring finger ki side me, ring mm. finger between ring finger and middle finger. Ring finger and middle finger me kya hai? Acha, this one you want to know this point? Yes. This is a point. no. You you have told us two points. One is uh, all lower joints. Yes, prostate gland is here. Okay. Yes. Okay. Lower and point. so we have to uh, we have to you press have to this. to stimulate this lower point nicely and put one black pepper here. Okay. And one magnet. And one magnet. It depends. Here. Magnet or seed. And then here lower area you have to massage and put seed here. Uh, okay. Green seeds will do. Green. Green gram. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much, ma'am. You are very okay, sweet. Thank you very much. You are also sweet. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. I Anuji. also want to learn. Uh, how can I learn? You are learning now, and tomorrow we'll meet tomorrow. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much, ma'am. Good night. Good night. Anuji, Anuji, please go ahead. It's my evening, madam. My evening. Uh, 
एक्चुअल में मेरे हस्बैंड को हाइटिस हर्निया का प्रॉब्लम है उसके कारण उनको एसिडिटी बहुत होती है और थ्रोट इन्फेक्शन भी रहता है हमेशा थ्रोट इन्फेक्शन क्यों रहता है Uh, मतलब एसिडिटी बढ़ने से जैसे एसिड आता है इन, गले में तो इन्फेक्शन ऐसा इन्फेक्शन जैसा लगता है हमेशा उनको थ्रोट में हम्म कब से है uh, तीन चार साल से है प्रॉब्लम सो यू हैव टू फोकस स्टमक पार्ट स्पेशली अपर पार्ट ऑफ स्टमक एंड यू नो दैट डायफ्रम लाइन या Yes, upper yeah. part of stomach, and uh, actually, all these problems are because of this hiatus hernia. So, in middle floor, okay, madam. This white again, all this white color area. Can you see this area? Yes, yes, Hello. yes. Massage this area. Try to find points here, and then, uh, then, then cover this area with seed. Uh, with seed, madam. Green lentil, oh. green gram. ग्रीन Uh, yes uh, we wanted to ask you uh, actually my mom has uh, a pain like a sound in her ear bhai ka ma ear points ear point in finger system this and every day massage this area and just put one seed black pepper here and black pepper here Okay. And uh, for any, do you know any points for like a nose allergy? Like every morning when we all three, like my mom, dad, and I, when we wake up that time, we have a problem sneezing and uh, nose block. Yes, liver point, and then this finger, middle floor, lung. Automatically, it will come, and also you know now liver points, nose, middle floor, and liver. Mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, the last question uh, sorry i have two more questions i have something for gas gas from gastric mm -hmm. stomach 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 mm -hmm. already i am telling you this is the same question many people have asked this stomach yeah and for diabetes what point should we do pancreas corner point oh. yesterday i told okay, okay. okay. thank can you very give, much can we give the chance to others okay uh, I think Siri Karni ji has not asked, or Siri Karni was asking, or Meena ji was asking. I got confused. Boy, Chang Chang, Sun Xiong Yang, Hai Tai Pu Ji, Yeah, Wang Gang Ki Hao Wa Gang Hai, Ah, Sun Xiong Yang, Okay, Yao Yao Ye Lo. I cannot hear. Jora ji, kindly you ask your question. You have done yes, level one and level two both. You can we my, can finish my the, evening, your question faster. My evening, uh, ma'am. Uh, my nail growth is very slow. Very low. It's growing, ma'am. Hmm. So shall I treat the uh, liver and what should I do? Liver, yes, you can. Liver. Oh, uh, that is enough. Yes. You can. Thank you, sleeper. Thank you so much, ma'am. Stay okay, blessed, yes. ma'am. You have done so much for us. Thank you so much, ma'am. Next participant, uh, with the name of Pinta Kaur or some number, please go ahead. One of them, on top. Yeah. Hi, ma'am. Ah, uh, this is Pravina. Go ahead. Go ahead. We are listening. Yeah, um, ma'am, my son is six years now. Actually, uh, uh, he is not speaking. We have diagnosed with autism, kind of mild ADHD. Uh, so, can you just tell me what to do? Okay. How old is he? Six years, ma'am. Just started. Hmm. Left hand nail. Left hand nail. Nail. Okay. and uh, if you can manage putting seeds on four direction of this nail 
Okay. This is one thing, and then brain points. Okay. So left hand nail. And Fine. if you can do ah. mudra for him in blessing stage. Oh, okay. This mudra. Root, you have to touch root of the nail. Fine, ma'am. Okay. But he will not do. <laughs> you will do for him. Oh, okay. Fine. In your prayers, so, in your meditation, just think about him and do this mudra with smile. Oh, okay. Fine, ma'am. Definitely. So in the head, uh, brain correspondence. Uh, yes, brain, of course. Uh, all the fingers. Yes, all the. What fingers. is the seed? But I need don't to do. Ev yes, you can just uh, one by one. You can give attention. So only in brain, I need to treat, no, ma'am. Yes. Uh, okay. Seed, anything like what kind of green seed? Gram. Green gram. Green gram. Green gram. Okay. So any organs uh, we need to uh, treat? Brain them? and liver, actually. Brain and liver. Okay. For liver, what uh, seed, ma'am? Green gram. Green gram itself. Okay. Yeah. Fine, ma'am. Thanks. Thanks a lot, ma'am. Thank you. Okay. Next participant, kindly go ahead with the name open the core once again. Okay. Probably doesn't want to ask or... Prayatam, Prayatam Ji. Prayatam Ji. Uh, thank you, sir. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, um, this is related to that seed therapy, ma'am. Um, when we put the seeds, um, you know, in both the hands, uh, sometimes the right hand and left hand, uh, for 24 hours when they wanted to keep, can they go ahead with the activities like, you know, if it is a put, if we put it on right hand, eating, by having the seeds on, on it, or should they remove and then uh, put on one hand and then one hand you have to uh, keep free so that you can do your routine activities. Okay, so in case if we are putting a left hand, ma'am, uh, you know, uh, can they wet that hand? Uh, you know, if you put don't the seeds. Your, don't wet your hand. Yeah. Okay, that's what uh, you know. I'm treating that with seed therapy, but many people are asking that question. So that's yes. why I want to don't wet your hand. Thank you, ma'am. You, you have very Everest level uh, kind of patience, ma'am. Thank you so much, ma'am. Okay, next next participant with the name open the call. Please ask your question. Hi, ma'am. Namita here. Ma'am, I wanted to know how to treat varicose veins. Heart point, liver point, and leg attention you have to give. Wherever is the... Uh, no problem in yeah. that area massage and put seeds uh, you can put this fenugreek seeds heart liver brain and then area wherever there is varicose veins and ma'am can uh, it can it be reduced cosmetically also the blue swellings jo lines just hoti do it just do it i i told you na can it be okay. hoga ya nahi it is not in i just do it Okay. Then it is in his hand. Okay, ma'am. Thank you so much. Okay, next participant with the name Bhupendra Kaur once again. Uh, namaste, madam. Namaste. Uh, actually, one of my friend met an accident and uh, the tailbone uh, had been cracked. There's a broken. So, uh, what uh, because of the tailbone? critical area? Tailbone, tailbone. Tailbone? tailbone? See, this area. Okay. So because of some critical area, they are not able to do any surgery or uh, kind of uh, treatment. So while sitting and bending, uh, she is getting too much pain. Tailbone, tailbone, this area? Yeah, yeah. Yes, massage yeah. nicely uh. in both hands. And every day do, and if you can do moksha also. And then okay. put seat. Okay, one more uh, doubt also I'm having, madam. Hmm. So now uh, this up to bladder point already I know that one in uh, main correspondence and uh, finger system. So mm -hmm. beyond that, uh, I mean uh, that it urethra any issues in that uh, sex organ male. So what we can do? Where is the exact point? This is the point. Male reproductive system outer. This you have to focus here. But I'll be confused with that. Why means there anus also will come right? Anus is here. Okay. 
little bit back and then here. So anyway, you should uh, fix seed like this. Five, six seeds put in a chain and then do like this. Even okay. if you're it, putting extra seed, no problem. It will work out for uh, urethra stringer also, uh, right? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay, and thank you. Massage ma nicely and then do it. Okay, okay, I will see. Okay, next participant with the name Bhupinda again. Can you ask your question? We can hear the baby sound. Okay, Kamalji, Kaurji, kindly ask your question. Kamalji ji, kindly ask your question. Hello, ma'am. Yes, Sumati ji, go ahead. Hello. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Sumati ma'am. Yes, Sumati ji, go ahead. Ask your question yeah. first. Namaste, ma'am. My, my mother is having pancreatic stone, 11 inch. What can I do? Similar thing which you had guided for gallbladder can be done or something else? Namaste, ma'am. Yes, can you repeat, please? My mother is having pancreatic stone. Pancre 11 inch uh, she is having is diagnosed and she's having that attack uh, frequently. Oh, so, I cannot hear your voice clearly. Please say again. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, yes. Yeah, I uh, my mother is having stone in pancreas. What can I do? Yes, which floor? Upper, middle, lower? Ma'am, that I don't know. Your, who is attending this lecture? Then how I will tell what, where to do treatment? Your mother is attending lecture? No, I am attending lecture. And then you have not observed? No, that thing, uh, my brother is taking care. Uh, she's far, not near. I'm, who I'm will not do taking... treatment? Then who will do treatment? I, when I go there, otherwise I'll, do, I'll ask her through phone only. Hmm? And now who is attending lecture? If you're attending lecture, then I have to, uh, then I know, I assume that you know points and I will tell. Okay, uh, we go to the next participant, uh, think, Vani think ji. And come back again. I will tell you. Okay. Yes, it means you're not focusing class. Okay, no. Vani ji. Okay. I think last two questions we'll take on because uh, you can appreciate that madam also requires a break since last five hours she is on the set. So now we'll just take last two questions. Namaste, yeah, go ahead with the name Bupinda. Hmm. Namaste ma'am, I want to know what can you do for general anxiety disorder? Ke liye kya kya ja sakta hai? Both fingers, this joint, according to tri-origin, this is anxiety joint. So आप इस जॉइंट को मसाज करना है, ट्विस्ट करना है, ब्लू कलर लगाना है। आप इस जॉइंट के ऊपर मुद्रा भी कर सकते हैं। एंड व्हेनेवर यू हैव एंजाइटी, यस, स्टार्ट डूइंग ट्विस्ट, डू ट्विस्ट ऑन दिस जॉइंट, दिस जॉइंट। यस, नाइसली डू, एंड देन स्लोली स्लोली यू विल सी दैट एंजाइटी इज गोइंग Thank you so much. Uh, last Thank participant you. with the name Bhupinder Kaur, kindly speak. Uh, yes. Uh, Loudly, please. Kindly speak. Sir, can you speak loudly, sir? We can see you, but we can't hear you.
Okay. I think. May I ask? May I ask one question, ma'am? Yes, you are always welcome. <laughs> okay. Uh, for, uh, for viral fever, uh, we have to do this the Newton nail touch, isn't it? This With one. With the homo tip touch. Is it like that? Yes. You can Thank take you, this. Yes. You can do that. Yeah. Not a uh, Newton uh, nail touch? Oh. Nail touch, yes, you yeah. can do. And yeah. then later in coming triurgen uh, session, I will tell you. You see, in triurgen, okay. we say this is uh, virus. Okay. And nail is bacteria. Okay. And this lower joint, homo joint, is connected with uh, bacteria. Okay. And then uh, protozoa, protozoa, and middle joint is fungus. Okay, okay, ma'am. Thank you. So you can start with this virus. Okay, okay. Try For the last three hours, I'm suffering with the viral fever. <laughs> Thank you so oh, much. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, do this mudra. Do okay, this okay. mudra. Yeah. yeah. And Thank then you. So fever, small intestine, meridian, blue color. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. And do energy points also. Actually. Okay, okay. Yeah. Mm. Thank you so uh, much. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you for being with us. We look forward for your joining tomorrow at same time, 6.30. Kindly join in early so that we start our session in the right time and give you more opportunity for questions. Uh, today, we have crossed more than one hour, 30 minutes extra. No issue, but tomorrow we expect you all to be in time. Join the classes. Thank you. Good night, smile night, and Shabak hai. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'll, I'll be ending the meeting. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.